Ezio Auditor. Brave of you to stand alone against me, but also quite foolish. Assassin. Welcome aboard the Slate Train, everybody. How is your moment of existence, all you digital people? Our next stop is Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. That's right. It's time to jump in to what I think is the last one of the games that I've played through. Um, and again, I don't even remember it, so we'll see. We'll see what happens. And jump in. I'm gonna you play. No thanks. No thanks! English subtitles, we'll put them on in case anybody wants to see what's going on. Let me check the sound on this real quick. I suspect it's fine, but I just wanna be sure. Expects to wake up one morning and find themselves caught in the middle of a war between two secret organizations. I know I did, but here I am. On one side are the Templars, better known these days as Abstergo Industries. They're in the business of control. Politics, economics, technology. They won't stop until every single one of us serves them. Literally. Fighting against them are the Assassins, a group dedicated to safeguarding humanity's free will. I was born into the Brotherhood. A couple of weeks ago, the Templars found me. They took me prisoner, strapped me into a machine they built, and put me to work. It's called an Animus. That's where I spent most of my time, exploring the memories of my ancestors, discovering entire lives locked deep inside my DNA. First, I revisited the life of Altair ibn Laahad, an assassin from the Crusades. The Templars wanted the location of something known as a Piece of Eden, an ancient artifact capable of bending people to their will. Once the Templars had what they were looking for, they decided my usefulness had come to an end. But Lucy saved me. Lucy. When things were at their worst, she revealed herself to be an assassin and helped me escape. I was hoping that would be the end of my misadventures. But we were just getting started. Back into another Animus I went. Now, I'm reliving the memories of Ezio Auditore da Firenze, my ancestor from the Renaissance, searching for a path forward. Through the bleeding effect, I'm becoming an assassin in more than just name. It will come in handy as the Templars prepare to enslave us all. They found us. They've crashed our hideout and we're fleeing the scene looking for a place to hide. Only there isn't any and time is running short. My name is Desmond Miles, and this is my story. Nice. I love the presentation of this. Just out the gate. Already got a cool feel. Some glitchy history channel stuff going on. <laughs> That's so good. I already know what to rename this one. Mario Auditore, let me hear. The glitchy history channel. I have to pause it before I start doing all that stuff. Give me one second as I uh somehow the category's not on here again. 
Let's see, Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. There we go. Glitchy History Channel stuff. I like it. I like it! Okay. Sorry about that. Let's jump back in. So, I need to be spamming X. And I now just notice this. Oh, I remember this. Okay. Okay. It's, it's starting to come back to me. I definitely played this one. But I know for a fact, I did not play the one after this. That much is true. Uh, Rebecca? What's going on? I have to run some diagnostics. I'll get back to you. You play action completed. Understand. Please wait. I have so many questions. The Vaticano, December 1499. It literally starts where we left off. <laughs> so cool. 1459, Profession Assassin. Well, this experience has been quite the education, although there's nothing in the history books following Ezio's disappearance from Florence as a teenager after the execution of his father and brothers. We now know that he fled with his mother Maria and sister Claudia to his uncle Mario's... Mario's. Mario. Oh, forgive me. I'm sorry, dear Mario. How could anyone ever say Mario? I said Maria. Maybe that's why. To his uncle, Mario's Tuscan Villa. <laughs> Trained there as an assassin, he prepared to hunt down the Templars, the man behind, the men behind the execution. And hunt them he did, killing them one by one until he reached their leader, Rodrigo Borgia. With the help of his uncle and the other assassins, he discovered Rodrigo's plan to open an ancient vault beneath the Vatican, supposedly leading to God himself. Ezio defeated, Rodrigo entered the vault alone and communed with a projection of Minerva, a member of an ancient race that existed before humans. This all sounds very far-fetched when I write it out like that now, doesn't it? Fortunately, we have the Admus records to prove it, so we didn't dream it or anything, unless we're all in a dream right now. Okay, this is getting out of hand. <laughs> I like it. Those are so cool. Oh, nice job on the reflection, guys. Very nice, very nice, very nice indeed. Okay, I think I climbed those. In the hands of the earth, than in the hands of man. Uncle, what can I say? We sent a single man against an entire army. I was worried. Quick, climb up. 
We have to get out of here. Oh, I thought he turned on us for a second. All right, so this is going to be like a little tutorial. I see. Hold Y to turn Eagle Vision on or off. Follow the highlighted path. Why does it have to be that one? Maybe that's just a, just to show me. Just to show me what to do. Ah! Okay, I guess I have to leave this on. <laughs> so off we go. Come on, climb up. You would not believe the things I have seen, Mario. Then be sure to stay alive that I might hear of them. I expect opposition. And I expect the Borgia to mourn the loss of many lives tonight. Alright. The graphics, obviously, are going to be a little bit better. Profession, date of birth, all these things. One of several important condottieri patrolling the Tuscan countryside, Mario Auditore was a born leader. He began his military career as a six-year-old when he played a significant role in the Florentine and Milanese conflict in the Battle of Ang Anghiari. While on an expedition to Monterci with his father, he alerted to he alerted the Florentine general, Micheletto. Oh my gosh. This is super, super hard to read. Big words. Hurt my brain. General Micheletto Attendolo to the appearance of several dust clouds over the road, which signaled a surprise advance by Milanese troops. Thanks to Mario, the Milanese attack was foiled. And the Florentines won the battle. Although Mario sided with Florence during Anghiari for most of his career, he defeated he defended the interests of his hometown Martergioni, derailing Florentine attempts to seize Tuscan territory. While Mario's younger brother <laughs> Remember? Mario? <laughs> While Mario's younger brother, Giovanni, moved to Florence in 1454 to pursue a career in banking, Mario stayed at the family's villa in Martergioni, stating in a letter to Giovanni that he preferred fighting like a man to filling out balance sheets. After Giovanni's death, Mario brought Ezio, Claudia, and Maria to the family villa and taught Ezio about the conflict between the assassins and Templars, and ever since, Ezio and his uncle have been inseparable. No more reading. Let's do this. This is cool. This is cool. This is like nothing you would expect in an Assassin's Creed game. If you had fast-forwarded to this moment from, like, number one. So good. God will see you pay for your crimes. You have desecrated the sanctity of this holy place. You condemn what you do not understand. We must go, Ezio. Now. Ah! Whoa! This is the voice of the devil. Don't go away from them. Okay. I guess I'll just... <laughs> He's just shoving people. <laughs> really, dude? You could do what I did. Okay. Did Rodrigo manage to hurt you? Barely. My armor blunted his attack. Be ready to fight. I like to go exploring. Got a fight now? What are you doing? Saving you from the look of things. <laughs> Not bad for an old man. Agreed. You still have some skills. I'm assuming the fighting is exactly the same. More there we go. Quest. Yeah. Not too much different. Excellent. Doing good pretty good boss. so far. Impressive. <laughs> Dang, dude. He's taking him out. Quick. I'm assuming that's because these are the first guys. Kara was trying to parry them. Apparently didn't really have to. I just pickpocketed. <laughs> By accident. Oh, this is good stuff, man. And this game starts out crazy right off the bat. Love it. Oh, dude. And I'm gonna let him get way ahead of me because.
are they talking about? Caught in the act without permits. I missed it. Now we've got the parry. Now we've got the parry. Good stuff. Keep a going. Oh, we gotta do one of these? Alright, here we go. <laughs> no, no. Oh, that's the first glitch. He's already grabbing stuff he shouldn't be. It's not a glitch, but, you know. One of those things that, uh, the, the clunky problem that was apparent in the first two games. Got a little bit better in the second one. We'll see how much better it is in this one. I know the games were made pretty close together in real life years. Where are we going, sir? Come on, Mario. is yours alone to make. Only do so quickly. Give it to me. You can do with it as you will later. Bene. Jump! Nice. Beautiful intro. gonna leave it there for a second so a little bit about this game let's see Assassin's Creed Brotherhood it's a 2010 game the game passed 1 million sales in a week <laughs> so we get it this is another good game let us see just how good. And then Minerva talked about the sun. She told of a disaster that occurred long ago, and another that is coming. Sometime far in the future, Vero. Then we need not worry about it. See, si. Perhaps our work is finished. Would that be so bad? This guy is very unpredictable in his routes. <laughs> Mario. We upgraded the arsenal while you were away. Ah, oh, and it is now customary for you to fire cannonballs at visitors. My apologies. We only installed them a few days ago. My men are still being trained in their use. Stay. Oh, oh. Come on. Don't you hate in games when your character, like, I'm barely moving forward. And he's just so quick. The horse is quick, he walks quick. And then the, the non-playable characters in video games are always just taking their time, like real life. Right? That's about the pace of a horse just kind of walking. But mine is always... There's no slow walk. <laughs> there is... I apologize. I just looked up and it said walk, you hold A. So if I hold A, he can walk slow. Okay. But what I said still holds true. What I said still holds true. Because in certain games, you, you've all been there where you're trying to follow the guy and they're just walking slow and your character does not, especially like in first person, your character does not walk slow. So you have to just kind of creep along with your joystick or your mouse and keyboard, whatever you're using. I mean, just creep. So I just now saw the walk button though up there. That, that helps for this situation. I don't pass him up. Welcome back. I was just doing this. Madonna. <laughs> Ezio! Look at Ezio! Let me see! Buongiorno! Salve, Mario! It's good to be Look home. Two of them. This place just Ooh, I figured out a, a sweet spot to get him to go just a little faster. Thanks that was cool. You. Thanks to you. Brother! 
Claudia. Graphics are just a smidge better. Home. I'm liking that. How is mother? It's always nice to see how the game evolves and improves. Returning, but I'm glad to see it with my own eyes. The Contessa of Forli is here to welcome you. I had no idea you were so famous. Katarina, here? Is it finished then? Is the Spaniard truly dead? Gather the others in Mario's study tonight. I'll explain everything there. Steal yourself, it. They will have many questions. Claudia, tell the Contessa I look forward to seeing her this evening. So, am I walking, following her, right? It appears so. It appears so. Um, the long walk. I mean, I could technically run to the spots that I need to go to. Sorry, I was I was uh trying to lurk here on a channel or two. On another channel, while I yeah. So I mean, if I wanted to, I suppose I could just run all the way to the spots I need to go to. But I figured. Why not follow her, right? She's going there anyway. I don't know if she has to be there. Let's find out. Let's see, it's gonna be right here. I guess I don't have to follow her. Let's see where she's going though. I don't know. All right, all right, all right. I'm coming. I always get stuck with this. Need some help. Salve. So many flowers. Your husband must be very lucky. I am the lucky one. I have you here to aid me. Let me see what I can do. Back there, I may have given you the wrong impression. Oh? I have no husband. The flowers are for a party. Am I invited? Ah, she's letting me know. Claudia Alditori's birthday party in the villa. If you are willing to help me again, I need someone with class to accompany me. What makes you think I have class? Ah. I could tell the moment I saw you. No one in this town walks with such bearing. I'm certain Ezio Alditori himself would be impressed. Oh? What do you know of Ezio? Claudia oh? thinks the world of him, but he rarely visits her. From what I gather, he's distant. <laughs> She is right. I have been. Oh no. You? The party was intended to be a surprise. Promise you will not tell Claudia. What will you do to keep me quiet? I am sure I can think of several <laughs> things. Guy. I'll be waiting to hear them when we get there. <laughs> He'll be playing games, man. He'll be playing games. Alright, let's set this down. Definitely the ladies, man. Now about earning my silence. I have something in mind. 
There is one condition. Anything. You must wait until tomorrow. If it pleases you, I will not stand in your way. It will be worth the wait, Ezio. Trust me. All right. So, all right, let's wait. <laughs> uh, what are we doing now? Let's go to those other exclamation park marks, parks. Gonna say points and marks at the same time. Who needs more coffee? I need more coffee. Okay, what's this? Um, there's two things. They're both outside the gate, so let's do one first. Talk to this guy. Buongiorno. Ezio. Mario bon Jovi. Murder me. I have lost his favorite horse. Do not despair. I will bring it back. God bless you, Ezio. Okay, let me, let me, let me drink some coffee real quick. Holy crap. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. There's no other horse here? Hey, how am I going to chase it down on foot? Oh, I guess if he doesn't run away. That's helpful. Get over here. What? I was pressing B. Oh, come on. Come on. Oh, this is stupid. <laughs> is this going to be a thing? <laughs> Get on the horse. Come on. Bring it back. Bring it back right here. Oh wait. That's not the stables. It said bring back to the stables. Uh, here. Grazie, Ezio. I can no longer keep up with the horses. Promise me you will enjoy Whatever way they're doing these tutorials. Do not spend as much time in battle as your Uncle Mario. My battles have already been won. That is good news. Arrivederci, Ezio. All right, checkpoint reached. So what's this over here we got? Let's go up there? Hmm. This requires me to go inside. Inside the walls. Um. Whoa! Oh, that's cool. Hold right trigger, move towards it. Nice. Ooh, that's badass. I like that. Talk to this guy. So, these are the new cannons. Yes, Signor Ezio. May I try one? Yes, but go on. Tell him. We cannot seem to make them work properly, and the fool who mounted them is nowhere to be found. Then it is up to me to find him. We do not want to waste your time. It is not any trouble. I have all the time in the world now. Find the engineer. Oh, that's a group of people. We don't need to read about groups of people. Okay, find the engineer. So it's gonna be him over here. Oh, come on. What? Are you going to do that already? This early in the game? Come on. Come on, Ezio. Let's not do this. Let's not be this way. We've got a long ways to go. Salve, Messere. We need you to fix the cannons on the battlements. Leave me be. I do not begin repairs before noon. Do you know what time it is? I make cannons, not clocks. If you are busy, someone else will fix them. Uno momento. No one else will touch my cannons. Whoa. Soldiers Got barks have coming no out. For Escort the engineer they back to the cannons. To work like magic. You need to feel her out. Give her a little uh, encouragement. We are only equipped oh, we have with to do simple this? cannons now. 
But I got hold Just of a design from France, yeah. A hand cannon. Something called a wrought iron murderer. Imagine firing a cannon from <laughs> your hands. <laughs> that is the future. That would be cool. I mean, like bazookas. What have you done? We used them. They were not ready for firing. You could have gotten us all killed. Let me see. <laughs> His breath is more fatal than our cannons. Only when you two fools are shooting them. There. Try it. There we go. Fire at the target dummies. Aim at something. You can use the cannon. Line. Nice. Okay. Let's see. We got the red trigger to fire. Boom. I wonder how you would actually aim these things. Anybody know how that works? It's crazy to think. They don't fire like a an actual gun. They don't go in a real straight line at all. At least, especially not these cannons. What is this? The late 1400s still? Crazy. Boom. In real life, you don't have those little aiming assist. Now, for the other one. I must go. Thanks for your help. If you hear the cannons tomorrow, do not worry. We will be practicing. Look at the guns on that dude. Too bad it will not do you any good. Very funny. Now fix the second cannon. So you'd think everyone in this time was uh. Whoop. Ooh, what do I have? I have all my stuff still. How cool is that? I lost a thing. Nice. Um, it's buff. Because, you know, no one, no one sat around playing games back then. Everybody had to work hard, really hard. Mostly due to the fact that, uh, they didn't have the cool technology we do. So you figure all the structures they built and everything were a lot harder to build then than they are now. So everybody and their grandma was like a construction worker. <laughs> Extreme. So all these dudes, even the weird, silly looking ones, are going to have guns on them. Press B to interact. Buongiorno, Ezio. Caterina. Bon Jovi. To what do I owe the pleasure of your presence here? I desire an allegiance. The papal armies have resumed their march on Forli. Your mercenaries would be a great asset to my cause. It is likely that I can give you what you seek. But we will talk later. Mother. Machiavelli. It is done. Though not, I think, as any of us expected. I entered the Vaticano and faced Rodrigo. No! Used the power no! of the papal staff against me, but I defeated him. Combining the staff and the apple, I gained access to the vault. There, the moving painting of the goddess Minerva spoke. She told of a terrible tragedy to befall mankind in the future, but gave hope of lost temples that will provide aid to humanity. And then she called out to a phantom, Desmond, as if he were there, standing beside me. After her warning, she vanished. That's a trip. Amazing. I cannot imagine such wonders. The vault did not house the terrible weapon we feared. This is good news. What of this goddess, this Minerva? Did she appear human? Yes, but her words proved otherwise. All of her kind died many years ago. I wish I could show you the magic she performed. Who is Desmond? And where are these temples Minerva spoke of? I do not know. Perhaps we must search for them. 
Tell me how it ended with Borgia. Did Rodrigo beg forgiveness? Make excuses? Promise power in return? No. None of those things. Interesting. I'm surprised he remained so composed. I let him leave. The Spaniard lives? Once our enemies are dead, we can speak of vaults and gods and ancient places. You should have killed him. We're sure to suffer for it. I am not here to debate the past. Together, we should discuss the future. No. I am leaving immediately for Rome. Ezio, I do not know why you spared him, but I trust your judgment. Machiavelli will come around. Sorry about that. There's a lot to read. I find it interesting. Uh, do I just walk out the door? Nope, I can't. What's going on? You go up here. He wrote Machiavelli. Normcore says he wrote in that book, "It's better to be feared than loved." What an a-hole. Nice little, home. nice little guitar playing the theme of Assassin's Creed, which I've grown fond of. Taking a bath, yes. Yakmo has joined the party. This is conquest number 5,982 for Ezio Auditory. <laughs> Ready to go again? No thanks, I got stuff to do. You don't need to ask. <laughs> One should always have the freedom to choose. Shh. What's that? <sighs> Probably just training exercises. Merda. I have to find Mario and rally the troops. It's for the Lurk Yakmo. I aim to lead them around back and flank our attackers. Stay out of sight. Uh, we getting all Lord of the Rings here around here? What's happening? What is happening? Dude, it's the Borgia. How did we not see this? They must have massed to the east during the night. We need to hold them off until the townspeople have escaped. I will take care of it. Cannons above the rampart. I intend to lead a frontal assault. Do you have it? I am keeping it safe. The Borgia must not be allowed to breach the walls until everyone is safely away. Insieme per la vittoria. Insieme. Uncle, Insieme. Be careful. I will. It's a him, Mario. Here we go. Out of the way, out of the way, out of the way, out of the way, out of the way. Of the way. Oh, this is hard to control like this. I think it 
kind of helps me out on its own, because... Yeah. Okay. It's not too bad, then. It's, it's kind of doing it for me. I just have to hold up and hold forward. Let's hope that horse is okay. Alright, we'll go around the other way. I gotta go this way, gotta go this way. This feels literally like an old Lord of the Rings game I played on the GameCube once. See, I gotta do this. I missed, I missed. Nice! Check out a few of them in one shot. Nice! That thing's getting closer. I want to take it out. Quick. You must fire at them, Fiori! Alright, let me take this thing out because it's, it's getting pretty close. They breached the walls. All our people die! My family will die! There you go. Uh, I can't do it. That worked! Let's take take out some of those big cannons over there. Or not. Man the cannon, man the cannon. I got it, I got it. Let's see, let's take out some of these guys here. Boop! This game has been just action packed so far. This is still really the start of this game. It's crazy. Take this guy out. Alright. Alright. This thing's getting close. This thing's getting close. Keep going. Ah. Come on, come on, come on. One more time. One more time. You do it. Very nice, very nice. ready to leave that cannon anyway. Oh, I gotta use a lift. Woo! I don't want to use my hidden blade. Oh man, that was brutal. Come on, we got this. Did I just finish him off with a gunshot? That was awesome. While in combat, press A to kick. Oh, breaking your pumps. Defense. Oh. Oh, I see. Nice! Okay. That'll take a little getting used to, but that was cool. Now let's back up a little bit. Kick him. And beat him up. There it is. A little sloppy, but I'll get it. Mario! I know you're there, Ezio! 
The Pope told me about you and your little group of assassins. And this! Give me the gun his friend fashioned for us! We've had too much bloodshed. I think a cleansing is in order. So consider this an invitation from my family to yours. Look at that gun. No. Oh, what happened? Shoot me? How did I forget this? Basta! I can walk. Look out! They are coming! Everyone retreat! Did they kill Mario too? Uh, I cannot I fight like did. these. Stand with me! Thanks, Norm. I like how the uh how he uses the gun like that. That's really badass. That's really cool. Now right, let's go see what else. I'm injured. Good. Okay, gotta go up here. <laughs> Look at this! I just go around kicking people. Huh, huh. That kick is hilarious. <laughs> I can just do this all day long. Okay, 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 I'm done. Hop up, hop up, hop up. I'm not done. Hop up, hop up, hop up. Okay, I'm done. I'm done. That was humorous to me. That was that was good. Select the next target and execute him with a single hit. I see. That's what's that's what's been uh, really cool about his fighting in this game. You can get like a streak going and change targets and just keep keep killing them in one hit after you've uh, finished off the first guy. Very nice. Let's try it. Like this, and then like this. Yep, and then like this. Oh, he ran away. I, I did. I held the left stick and I, I did the... It keeps telling me to do that, but I did it. Okay, there we go. Press right bumper to access the weapon wheel. Select your pistol. Okay. Got it. Your work Wi-Fi is slowing down, but you're still lurking. Appreciate it, Norm. What? What is going on? That was weird. You guys see that glitch? I can't. I will hold them back. Stop! Wait for us! We thought you had been killed, Sir Ezio. Not yet. Where does this passage lead? To the north, outside the walls. I am surprised it exists. <laughs> Let me through. I must go help the troops. Yes, whole new secret. Where's mother? Oh, wait, I was already here. All right. Never mind. I am here, Ezio. Grazie, Dio. I could not leave Grazie, out. Dio. Dio, Dios. Protect God. Thank God. I think I got that, right? I thought he would be waiting for us. The Borgia infantry are circling the town! Mario is dead. You must leave this place. Take mother to Firenze. Get me a horse. You are not coming with us. 
Where are you riding? To Roma. Go, my son. Destroy them. But remember for whom we assassins fight. Okay, I'm gonna leave it here for a second. Sure we're done with this cutscene. It's been kind of a long sequence. Jacked up. So I guess we both got shot, huh? Mario and myself. I'm a little concerned about my memory. No idea why I can't remember these things. POE? Could one of you tell me what's going on? Sorry, Desmond. Peace of Eden. In the Vatican, Minerva talked about other temples, that they're the key to preventing whatever terrible thing is about to happen to the Earth. Right. Find the temples, I'm convinced we need to get our hands on Ezio's Apple of Eden. Minerva altered it somehow when she touched it. Wait, we're at the Auditore Villa. Yes, it's our last safe house in Italy. It turns out the Templars are watching the border. Ezio hid the POE sometime in 1507, but when I try to access that DNA sequence, he seems to be remembering something else. Like a memory inside a memory? Yes, exactly. Maybe. Exactly, maybe. I believe you experienced something similar back at Abstergo, didn't you? Subject 15 exhibited memory within memory-like patterns, but she was pregnant. The memories of both the fetus's father and mother were competing. Desmond's not pregnant, at least, as far as I can tell. Might just have had a big lunch. Can you skip ahead to a later memory? No, it doesn't work. Well, that sounds familiar. We couldn't access Altair's later memories until You Desmond know guys, always picking on each other. Then it's possible something similar has occurred here. Ezio's troubled state is being transposed onto Desmond, destabilizing the memory. Either that, or Rebecca's just not a very good engineer. Thanks, asshole. What? I'm simply listing possible explanations. And that is amongst the most likely. Touchy. This place isn't secure. Cell phone surveillance can see right through the walls. Don't you mean satellite surveillance? Are you kidding? Abstergo upgraded his cell towers ages ago. The waves go through everything above ground. They're gonna find us. No, they aren't. Come with me. I know I was saying that that's the voice of Liquid Snake. I don't think he is anymore. That other guy with the glasses, I forget his name. I don't think he is. He sounds a little different now than he did before. The, the voice is, is a little clearer inside. for some reason. We're not getting in this way. What's her next move? The road just loops back into the highway. This is not a good place for us to be right now. Do we have any tarps? We need to cover up the van. I really hate to stress this, yeah, but we are running this out guy. of time. Well, help us then, Sean. Do you have any ideas? Sean. I don't know. Maybe there's another way into the sanctuary. Hey, I think I've got something. Okay, we're going to follow that ghost in just a second. Guys, I'm going to leave it here. Thanks for hanging out. Um, it's been kind of a chillax little, little morning doing this. Um, I will be back shortly. Okay, guys. I'm back. Thanks for being patient. For those of you on YouTube, welcome back. This is part two of... Assassin's Creed, I'm Sly the Game, and this is a random fact. We're going to continue on the theme uh, from last time. I find this guy interesting, so why not? The Da Vinci Dude. Leonardo Da Vinci's famous painting, The Mona Lisa, sits behind a six-foot bulletproof barrier. <laughs> you can see the painting on display at the Louvre Museum in Paris, where it's been kept for more... In 200 years. That's nuts! That is nuts. Let's 
follow this let's follow this ghosty guy. What's it going on here? Oh, I just remembered all kinds of parts of this game now. There are follow sequences me. like this I gotta do. This is weird. That's cool that we're in this location and it doesn't look like it's really changed all that much. We got the street light thing going on though. Desmond, so bizarre. that was pretty awesome. It just felt natural. We can get in through here. Good job. We'll just wait up here then, shall we? Yeah, all alone with, with massive targets painted on our backs. Why won't this turn on? It's great to be out of the animus. This isn't exactly That's my idea thing. of a good time. What? Well, let me guess. You're more the embedded six type. What? Uh, Desmond. I know how to have fun. I can't. That's yes, very convincing. Sir. Yeah, I'm convinced. Okay, okay. After we save the world, I'll show you. Wait, can I get that in writing? <laughs> we have light. There we go. All right, so me and Chickadee are pretty much a thing. That's that's obvious. They got they got some chemistry going on. We saw that at the end of the second one. What was that? I don't see any. Ooh, look at this. What is this? And I'm running into them. They're like solid Run. objects. I can't get go through them. That's interesting. Oh. Okay, so he's here. like able to see what? the memories. Ezio and the villagers. After the attack, I can see them now. I know it's difficult, but try to compartmentalize, Desmond. Focus on the present. What if I can't stop the visions? How long before I start painting symbols on the walls? Don't joke about that. Sixteen is dead. We're focusing on the present, okay? Okay, press any button. Stuck. I can get under there. Ready. Any chance you can lift that gate? Not unless you want me to end up like that skeleton. I'll find a way around. And here we go. Climb time. <laughs> All right, let's see. Anything in here? Pick up or something? No. Let's suggest to do it. This is fun. This has started out really nice. Watch out for bats. Where? I meant in case you see any. Remind me not to make you a lookout. A couple little cheesy jokes going on while Desmond. we're, uh, you know, More saving ghosts. the world. I'm here, okay? So weird Stay how they're like me. solid objects sometimes. Can't pass through these ghosts. Uh, go this way. What's up here? Doesn't look like anything. So I don't know what the point of making that a climbable structure Did was. Fall on you? Desmond, we can't climb this. How about you give me a boost? That's a bad idea. I could throw you into the air and you grab the ledge. Even worse. Follow me. <clears throat> okay. How about this? This, uh, this thing is so like old, I can't believe... It even works. Nice Did you think job. about that? I aim to please. I mean, I wonder how old these tunnels are. <laughs> Middle ages, probably. They're super old. Luckily, the beams still hold our weight. After all this time in the Animus, I'm not so sure. Yeah, I didn't want to say anything, but you're really getting fat. Ouch. I even told Rebecca to widen the Animus. Seriously?
I'm all. I was turning the camera to see. I'm like, wait, I am. Off we go. <laughs> Ready. <laughs> How do you like that for uh, insecurities? It's so bad. I have to even check my friggin' avatar. What does this world come to? You know, when I came here last. When Ezio came here. Yeah, I meant Ezio. Oh, I should have put you through all this. Hang it's on, not right. Hey, all joking aside, I'm having the time of my life. It's thanks to you. Just focus on where you're going, okay? Oh, how sweet! Oh, I'll go down here. When did this become my job? If I pulled all the levers, then what would be left for you? <clears throat> Nothing. Nice try. Ready? I just noticed the zipper. Ooh, that was close. The zipper on the back Found of this hood. Like, I've never seen a hood with a zipper on it. Look at that. Huh. What? Something's open. No. Get away from there! Stop it! I have to really walk all the way. I was trying to walk away, but every time I pressed any button at all, besides the walking button, he would uh, turn around I'm stuck over try to here. grab that I lever down there. The water. That's what was happening. Ezio gets a bath with Katarina Sforza, and I get a swim in a toilet. Yep. Pretty much. I've got this one. Nice. There's another lever up ahead. Come over here. Um Trying to think of how to get over there. Come on, Desmond, let's go. I'm working on it. Wait a minute. Um Do I have to swim? Is that what's happening here? Hang on a second. Over here, Desmond. I guess so. I'm just going for it. Oh man, it's freezing! Stop whining! It's easy for you to say. You aren't swimming in medieval toxic waste. Ugh. How do I get out? I smell terrible. That is pretty gross. You're exaggerating. Shut up. Excuse me. Wait a minute. Did I climb up here? I guess so. Oh, that's a weird camera angle. I like it. Remember, this is the time. Oh, that's so life. good. Yeah, yeah. They do a good job with this, with like camera work to, to get it to feel dangerous. Ready? Go for it. Okay, it. How come you don't have to get it's so strange? Because you're here. Charming. Aren't I? Come on, I guys. We don't need this Thanks. Disney stuff right now. Ezio! Get on the other side! Hurry! Alright, 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 alright. On my way. Great. The bridge is out. We can't jump this. I have an idea. You'll have to help me. Stand at the edge and get ready. Sorry, I had to do something. Ready. Okay, press any button. Oh, nice! That was cool. Made it! Let me see. Oh, you go on ahead. I'll just stay here to die in the dark with the bats. Jump across. Nice work. The bats will be disappointed. For now. 
Oh. Oh. Okay. Wait. What's this? I have found an entrance. Oh, nothing. It's a nothing. Alright, we gotta go back this way. So I never did ask the question of the hour of the episode. Ooh, this is cool. We've got an upsy and a downsy. Okay, well the upsy's blocked. That's good. I ha it's because I didn't actually pre-think of a question, but let's see, we're talking about the Mona Lisa. Let's see, it's a Mona Lisa behind bulletproof glass. So they protect some sort of sentimental I'll item. So the question will have Good. to do with something sentimental. Get that bridge down for you. Uh, I did the last one. And I'm okay, sure what's the most sentimental item right? that you own? How about that? <laughs> Very funny. That's what I could think of. What is the most sentimental thing that you own or have owned before? Put it in the comments below. If you're here live with me, you can chat with me. Right Thank now. You, Desmond. Sup all over grinder. I was just asking, what's the most sentimental item that you own? Okay, wait a minute. Go up there. Oh. Now it's my turn to even the score. There we go. Nice. There. Look at her go, nice. man. It's a start. We got My magic? Ugh. This is far better than magic. Uh, okay. Let's see. Up here. Am I supposed to like I can't I can't see? Okay, I can't get up there, so let me go down here. Come on. Go down. Nice. You keep everything that's gifted to you. <laughs> well, there's Overgrinder's answer. It's just changed over the years for me, personally. Um... But at this moment, probably this go. really, really old deck of cards I have. There's a whole story behind that that I will reveal at some point. But yeah, it just changes. It depends. Or maybe this bear. Thanks. Actually, it's, it's this bear that I have. That my grandmother made me by hand. I've had it my whole life. It's the last thing I have that survived all the stuff that's happened. Okay. <sighs> Just gotta say this. If they ever had a kid, these two, um, it would be the best gymnast in history. <laughs> I can see the sanctuary. All right, let's go. Sanctuary time. Did you get some good sleep, Grinder. What is this? Is that the loading screen now? Oh, it is. That makes sense because I'm not in the Animus anymore. That may be the first actual loading screen that we've had as Desmond. Wow. It's so weird that, uh... So Ezio must have come back here way after the attack. But why? Desmond! Right. Let's open that door. Your internet dropped you last night? See, you're grinding so much that even the internet can't keep up with you. Everything needs a balance. You can't overgrind, you can't undergrind. I believe in balance.
Hold wide to turn eagle vision on or off. Try using that special sight you learned from Altair. There's something here. <laughs> Can you open the damn bookcase, Desmond? <clears throat> Man, these allergies are killing me. You guys did it. About bloody time. What's that? Looks like something Ezio left behind. There are numbers underneath it. 1419, 1420, and 1421. Maybe you should lie down for a bit. No, it's all right. I'm fine. Whoa, they really built this place to last. No signs of structural damage, no cell signal either. Should be safe to set up. Let's get the Animus down there. Nice, Grinder. You're close. You're close. Remember, it only counts days you stream, too, so you don't really have to do it every single day. You could take, like, three days off, and it still sit there at 295. Okay. It goes based Everything's off of right how Sean, hide the van many you have while you're streaming. Make sure you aren't followed. What? What is that smell? It's my clothes. They smell like you swam through a sewer. It was Lucy's idea. Wait a second, guys. We need power down here. There's a line running nearby I can hook into, but the water... So this is their new base, their new setup. Oh, yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah. Anything else you two would like? You know, some caviar, perhaps? Maybe you'd like me to, to knit you a lovely hat. No? Fine. Follow me. This is the most we've ever played as Desmond, by the way. Like, in one sequence it's really cool it's so strange being in this place again but in modern times it's so bizarre so look his hoodie so hung up on it you can zip it all the way up and then it's got another zipper in the back that's so strange i mean i like the design it's just i've never seen it before i think it's cool Is that a typo grinder? Bravely? Oh yeah, this is the uh, this is number three now in in order of the of release. It's really interesting. Right, look around Monte Regioni for circuit boxes. Rebecca's little doodahs, they'll reroute small amounts of electricity to the power line underneath the villa. Don't ask me how they work. If I understood that, I wouldn't be the fella hiding the van. Alright, so I guess I gotta follow this to figure out how do I get up there? Can I climb this way? Yep. Yep. Yeah, okay, I gotta get up to the toppy top top. This is so cool! Bravely Default 2, huh. That's a new game on the Switch, you said? Wait a minute, I don't understand what just happened here. Doesn't tell me. Power rerouters connected, 0 out of 4, so... It Just have to go around and find them, I guess. How would I find them? I'm supposed to follow. Hang on, I gotta go back around. I remember when I played this last, I had to follow the. What's 
so weird. Look at this. Modern times, man. It's so crazy. I have to follow the the line, right? The power. Okay, so let's see. This is number one. And maybe it'll show me where the next one is. Okay, Overgrinder says it's an RPG. Bravely defaults. An RPG, basically, basically Final Fantasy V, but with new stories and graphics. Ah. Okay, so now you got to follow these. All right, where do I? What do I do? No, maybe not. Where do I find the others? I thought I could find it with this vision on, but maybe not. Maybe. Maybe, maybe not. I remember there being one down here somewhere, I think. Yep, look at that. Aha, got one. Um, well, yeah, you have to start from the beginning, Grinder. That's why, because this this is... I just started this one today. I um, mean, it's in modern day, but the story of Assassin's Creed, so many people do this, I've noticed. They'll they'll play a game when it comes out. Oh, this is the newest game to play, but they like have no idea what's going on in the story because they don't follow it. Uh, but it's it all goes together, from what I've seen. So, long story short, Assassin's Creed seems to be about a guy who's uh, rediscovering his ancestors' memories by jumping in this, like, thing called an animus. Some crazy machine, and... And so it's a story of modern time and, uh, and his ancestors. It goes back and forth. About, like, you know, Knights Templar and, you know, Illuminati-type stuff. They, they, they've done a real good job at, like, mixing everything together. History and sci-fi. Right now, I'm in modern times doing this crazy long sequence. Wait, do I just follow where it goes? I think so. There's one right there. does look cool. Yeah, this game's very cool. There it is. There it is. I'm back. Just in time. The sun's rising. Yes! It's booted. We're good to go. Did you miss me? No? Anyone? Hello? Am I speaking out loud? Hello? Workaholics. Let's get started. Yeah, but if we had asked him that same question, he would be a smartass, so... That's what you get, Sean. That's the way it goes. Treat others the way you want to be treated. Um, am I am I leaving? Do I talk to somebody? Hang on. You seem focused. I've been busy patching new systems into baby here. It's Peanut's so birthday. What? Is Desmond gonna be able to relive memories this time? I'll say hi to Peanut. Matter of fact, he will. I'm gonna go say hi to Peanut. Do you have any clue about those numbers under the drawing? Fourteen nineteen. 1420, 1421. Maybe something to do with the Hundred Years' War. Or, or wait, in 1419, Pope Martin V arrived in Florence, right? He, he left for Rome. Well, in now I know who I'm reading. And that was the same year Brunelleschi yeah, began building peanut. the Duomo. And in 1421, um, in 1421, yeah, I'll have to do some more research, I think. What else you got to say? So, 
What do you think of Monteregione? This is not Monteregione. Monteregione existed in the Renaissance. Ask me how the town was in 1554 when it was seized by Florence, and I'll tell you. Huh. I figured you'd like it nowadays. Seems not to have changed much. Exactly. History is the study of change. Change is life. When things become static, it means they're dead. That's an interesting way of looking at it. Touche. I liked that response. My work requires attention, Desmond. Can I punch him? You know I love talking about this stuff, Desmond, but we have what work to do. What are we going to do about Abstergo? Wait it out. As soon as we find the apple, I get in contact with our other teams in Europe, but as far as Italy goes, we're on our own. It'd be nice to have some help from above. Our top assassins are busy gathering info about the Templar satellite launch. We've pinpointed several possible facilities in the US, China, and Russia, but there are no clear leads yet. Right. So. Let's get out of here always a tech geek now nah, I was in the sports always a tech my geek. leg and started playing with computers who knew that coding could be just as exhilarating as strapping on a board and dropping out of a helicopter <laughs> just FYI you might want to get your adrenal glands checked you know because that that is not normal nope <laughs> a lot of people like that though You might want to get your adrenal glands checked. <laughs> ah, stop it! There. It kept going away when it said press any button. We'll talk later. Can I just go in here then? I, I don't understand. There we go. Seems like this game, the the mechanics haven't really changed at all, which is band, fine I've by made me. Some improvements to the Animus, and I've also patched in a new VR training program. Well, this is different. You can show up Just as I say that, it's different now. Up from your ancestors. <laughs> Let me open one of the mission. Ooh, what's this? What am I doing? Kill streak one. Oh, I see. I could just keep up the uh, slaughterization. <laughs> this is nuts. Oh, I broke my streak. Dang it. I was doing so well. Aw oh, man, I screwed up. Let's see how long I can keep this one. Let's get a few more in there. Ah! Oh, I had it! I had it! I had it! I had it! I killed two more. Two more. Ah, one more. That was cool. Short kill streak, streak training complete. <laughs> Pretty good you kill streak. You can access more VR missions through the Animus desktop. As you complete training sessions, I'll add additional challenges. To stop your subconscious from rejecting Ezio's later memories, you're going to have to live them in the order his genome recorded them. Highlight sequence two for me, Desmond. Good, now select it and you're going to see the memories inside. Once you've unlocked a memory by accessing this menu, you can relive it as many times as you want. Oh, okay. One of okay. their memories I just want to forget. Desmond, this is very important. If you need to take a break, log out of the Animus. You can leave the machine whenever you like. I'm all set to go. Don't worry. One last thing. As you raise your synchronization by executing events the way Ezio lived them, you might even discover some repressed memories. Okay, let's get started. Select the first memory. Desmond. I've been looking at those gibberish five-digit codes from the end of Subject 16's files, and I seem to have discovered a remarkable coincidence. The codes correspond perfectly with coordinates inside the Animus. Hey, Michael. 
I've tagged the landmarks, pinpointed by the coordinates with eye icons in the database. Now, odds are you won't find anything there, but... Well, who knows? Yeah, if you want to see when I'm going to play stuff, you can just check my um, Twitch schedule. I have a, I'm updating it every day. Uh, so you can see what's coming up during the week. Calmatevi. The pain will end soon. Where have you brought me? So I'm 102 minutes into the stream. A man left you here. If there was anything you might have Only wanted this. to see that you missed. You are to meet Messer Machiavelli in front of the Mausoleo di Augusto. Let me help you get dressed. The same man who brought me here gave me these clothes. Si, Messere. Uh, the beginning of this was really cool. By the way, there's a horse soon. It's a trap. Can't get on it. Ah. Good to know. Yeah, the first hour of this was really, really cool. I, I really enjoyed it. Um, so far, this whole trilogy, I think, I think though, the Ezio, I think two and three right here go together more than one did. Or what is left of it with each other. Borgia came to power. And the mausoleo. Unfortunately, you cannot see it from here. How about from the top of that church? Yes, but the stairs up are closed. That should not be a problem. Vi ringrazio di tutto quello che avete fatto per me, buona donna. Addio. You dare me to try this game without upgrading the armor? Find a doctor to heal the wounds from the villa attack, climb on the church tower. Okay. Oh. I'm still hurt, so. Let's go to the doctor. How do I get down? I have to walk. I can't I do no parkour. How you doing, Michael? Good night's sleep. Ah, oh, my arm. Una moneta. Salute. I require medicine. Ah, let me look. Someone your age cannot recover from a wound like this with medicine. Here is something to dull the pain. You will heal over time. Grazie. Four out of five doctors would suggest leeches, but they have not proven effective against such things. However, I can recommend several good colleagues around the city. Do you need anything else? Does something ail you, friend? Are these the horses you were talking about? Okay, so there's the medicine. Nice. Climb to the top of the church tower. Let's look and see what, uh... Me and the sticker printer, we're gonna make a mint. <laughs> hey! Um... Michael. I ended up doing that game a little bit last night, and uh, I know you're new here. I got this thing that just happens almost every stream. This whole time, I end up having a this whole time moment where I will legitimately... Okay, go back to the house and take the horse. Where I'll legitimately um, realize something, you know, that I forgot that's really stupid or whatever. Sorry, what are you talking about? What horse? Oh, that horse. Go oh, figure. It was one of the it was one of the biggest this whole time moments I've ever had. And I couldn't even yell it. I couldn't even yell it. I had to I had to keep it down. Okay. So before I do this though, I want to see 
Do I need to do these virtual trainings? I feel like I do. I don't know why. Tell me what happens if I do all these. Or should I just skip them? I mean, I know Assassin's Creed so far has shown that doing these things actually does pay off. It gives you something. Is there like some special super secret hidden shiny? Or some sort of kill eight targets using only the hidden blade? Or some sort of like, you know, cut scene at the end? I can't be seen, right? I can't be seen. What's going on here? Okay, well that's easy. I guess if they're not moving around that makes it a lot easier. If you get all bronze ones you can get the... Uh, Raiden Cosmetic? To find all glyphs you'll get to meet Subject 16. Ooh, so I don't have to do these though, is that what you're saying? What happens if I get all gold ones and not bronze ones? Just curious. It's just a flex? And I don't need to do this. I could. But, um, we're here to tell the story. We're here to tell the story. It's a different channel that would be doing stuff like speedrunning and completionist stuff. Uh, but if it has, if it has, like, extra cutscenes and, and it's important, you know, like some DLC content would be, you can guarantee I'm going to do that stuff. Um, but I have no time to flex. I have no time to flex. I legitimately... I think I just reloaded a game. Oops. I legitimately am trying to get through as many games as possible until the day I'm dead. And that's exactly what I'm going to do. In fact, I'm going to try not to die because that far into the future, I, can I will hopefully be cloned and continue side. my quest. Never end. For the world itself ends. Okay, select medicine. Got it. All right, we gotta take the horse. Gotta take the horse. The horse kind of... I don't like taking horses unless I have to travel a long distance. Kind of annoying. Okay, here we go. Let's climb up. Let's climb up. Back. Whoa, 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 whoa. What was that? I did not mean to do that. Come on, you can make it up there. Maybe I have to maybe I have to climb up here. Want me to send you a pick of the So is that Raiden or Raiden? I'm thinking like Metal Gear and and Mortal Kombat. Which one is it? <laughs> yeah, sure. You wanna send a picture of it? If that's all it is, I'm not worried about it then. Here we go. So why to synchronize? Splunk! That's a big jump. The peasant is resisting arrest. We will show him how things operate under the Borgia. Machiavelli can wait. Raiden. Okay. Gotcha. I'll look at it on this uh, next break. I'm going to take in a few minutes. Thanks for hanging out so far, guys. As I've said before, I have a Twitter. I have a YouTube. For anybody who wants to see the old Assassin's Creed videos, or any other game for that matter that I've done on Twitch, you can see them on YouTube soon. As I have them all there set to private, I'm going to start uploading them, publishing them as public very very soon I'm talking like March this coming month so it's finally happening I know some of you have been waiting for that 
and they'll be cut down into one hour segments or less. But for now, I do have all my magic tricks on there. You want to see those? I upload one every 10 followers. Whoa! Don't turn around. Don't turn around. Do you know what that pig face is about? For anybody who's just joining us, welcome. I am on my. about to finish my second hour into this. You can just catch the VOD after I'm done if you want to see the beginning. I'm going to play a little more Grim Fandango tonight. Um, and hopefully be able to finish it. I'm supposed to tail these guys, right? Hang on a second. I want to make sure I'm doing this right. Tail the guards, okay. Sometimes tailing people in this game can take forever. Slight of magic. <laughs> Yeah, did you not know that, Michael? I thought you knew that for some reason. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a, a practitioner of magic. I do like magic. Not the gathering, <laughs> but magician magic. Yeah, that's the one thing you can see. I post them on Twitter, but I just changed that on this last trick. I realized that Twitter kind of limits you because you can only post like 45 second videos, so. Ouch! Pick a target, Ezio, pick a target. What was that about? Ouch. Yeah. Oh, you should have seen the, the combo I had going on my first um, training sequence during the cutscene where they, like, show you the animus and you're forced to do a... I had killed, like, 20 straight. It was awesome. Um, yeah, that's a cool feature of this game. She was beautiful. <laughs> she was. Until that porco defiled her. I wish he just killed her. I wish it just killed La Mia Mata. People who saw her grow up cheered when he spat on her. Smiles on their faces oh. when her neck... I understand. How can oh. you? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Was Hang on innocent. Second. I saw the armor. I, I saw the armor. Family to the rope. To treachery. Il Carnefice watches from his home on the hill above. He threatens to hang me if I cut her rope. Okay, I'm going to leave it here for a second, guys. I will be right back. Um, take a quick break. Hey, I just saw that armor, by the way, dude. Oh, my gosh, the one you sent me. Okay, so that is Raiden, actually, uh, from Metal Gear. <laughs> Ooh, that's my favorite series of all time. Uh, that would be Metal Gear 4. And or maybe even uh, Metal Gear... Rising or Revengeance. There's two different versions. Um, yeah, it's awesome. So, uh, good stuff, good stuff. All right, I'll be back, guys. Okay. I am back. For those of you on YouTube, hello again. Part three of part three. Go ahead and do when this you are ready, mission. Take her down. I will deal with Il Carnefice. Thanks, Michael. Welcome back to you too. I guess you never left. So beginning hour three. Let's check out this dude. See what he's all about. I was correct. I just wanted to double check myself on that uh Metal Gear thing I was talking about, and yes, they, they were paying tribute to the great and legendary Metal Gear Solid series. 
If you're a gamer, you have to play the Metal Gear Solid series. It was such a big series that it's even bigger than the Assassin's Creed series, arguably. Um, and Assassin's Creed is a, is a mammoth in gaming. So, always have a special place in my heart for that series. Metal Gear changed gaming forever, especially with part one. But that's a discussion for another time. It's a discussion for when I actually take you guys through that series. Nice work down there. Uh, not Spoosh. Uh, we're about to kung fu fight. Good night, artist. Oh, that's cool. Oh. I hate when the, I hate when the, uh, like, trees and stuff get in your way. I really hate that. They can't see. It's the worst. That happens a lot. That's the only, oh, yeah, I forgot about that streak I can have going. All right, sorry. Streak time. There we go. There we go. A little better. That makes fighting so much easier. Oh, man, how do I break out of that again? I'm sorry. I'm, I'm so confused at breaking free. I'll get used to that in a little bit, and then I'll be fine. And I'll be kicking butt, no problems. I'm still trying to get used to it. They, they threw a wrench in there by throwing, pressing right bumper and something else. I'm like, wait a minute, wait a minute, what am I doing? Oh, right trigger and B to... So. That was the worst combat I've had so far. Throwing new moves in there in the middle of my fight. How dare you? Yeah, so Michael, um... I say again, if you're not familiar, I am slight of game because I thought, how do I combine magic and video games? I love them both. So I just randomly came up with that name one day. Yeah, if you go to my YouTube, if you don't have Twitter or anything, it's easier to find on YouTube anyway, you can go to my um, go sort by playlist and you'll find my magic playlist on there. I thought I saw something up here. I guess not. Whoa! Easy there. Easy there. Okay. Is it time to kung fu fight? Guess not. Excuse me. Pardon me. Coming through. Coming through. I was saying earlier also, if I get to, uh, I promised the smell test, who's my 50th follower here, as I call them passengers. Um, and I'd, I'd play Black Flag, but he gave me permission to go through and, and just keep doing this in order. They know that I like to do this, these games in order, all games. So, but when I get to Black Flag, I will, I will finish Black Flag and then I'll come back and, and see if I can do some DLC for like part two and, and this game. I'm sure there's DLC that's pretty cool and adds to the story. It's you. And then what I'll continue my path to towards Valhalla. I thought you had sent for me. Never. News of the Villa attack has spread across the city. We were certain that you were dead. Not yet. I am still very much alive. The Borgia must not discover that you escaped them. Accompany Machiavelli through Rome, encountering dangers along the way. All right. Fact of the hour. This strange character, Leonardo da Vinci, we're going to continue with him visiting graveyards. He he actually dug into graveyards supposedly at night, to steal corpses and study to study human anatomy. <laughs> Weird stuff. All right. Oh, and I was asking earlier, Michael. We were talking about the 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 Mona Lisa. I found that interesting. Check this out. Let's see if I can pull that up again. Da Vinci's famous painting, the Mona Lisa, sits behind a six foot. Bulletproof barrier. You can see the painting on display at the Louvre. I don't know how to say that. Uh, museum in Paris. That's been kept for more than 200 years. So the question last was, what's the most sentimental thing you own? Follow me. Now I gotta think of some. Take care not to draw any 
Undo think of something things. else for this next uh when do I ever? fact that I just read. <laughs> Have you ever dug up a grave? Uh Crazy, right? Yeah, Leonardo, um he was he was a strange character. I've been reading facts about him for a while. He was the last game. Long in Roma without supplies. He was weird, but he I he's a and the guards I'm wondering if he was even smarter than Einstein. It's possible. Fortunately, I can help. Some of the stuff he invented and came up with, like designs for helicopters and armored cars Perhaps back then, that never came to fruition, but they've discovered Perhaps it. Perhaps you will listen to reason. As soon as I hear some, I will let you know. We make working people the Fabro! Alright, so this is what you're talking about, right? Let me just look around and see what they got. So this is the armor. This is repairing. These are the weapons. I'm gonna save up. Get some better weapons. Alright. Um. Oh, I have to buy this. Oh, I have to. I see. I have no choice. Okay. So I have to get these. At least. And then I have to get these. Okay. It makes me. I think I could beat the game with only the default armor. Uh, I guess I probably could. I beat this game before. It's just been a while. This is for sure the last one that I've played, though. Like my dagger. Which one's my dagger? Is that my dagger? Or is that my dagger? No, that's my sword. This is my dagger. But I'm not going to Firenze. Oh. There will be no peace until we rise up against the entire Borgia family and the Templars who serve them. I do not recall such brave talk at Monte Regione. How could I have known that they would find me so quickly and that they would kill Mario? Rodrigo surrounds himself with snakes and murders. I'm probably gonna upgrade my armor. <laughs> Even his daughter Lucrezia has been sharpened into um, one of his I'll most I'll play like this for a while though, we'll see. But she pales in comparison to the man behind the villa attack. He is ambitious, ruthless, and cruel beyond imagining. The laws of men mean nothing to him. He murdered his own brother to take power. He knows neither danger nor fatigue. Those Maybe I can make that a channel point soul, redemption or something. To join the oh, by the way, I made the raid the thing cheaper. And I dropped it down quite a bit. Kneel at his feet. Figure 15,000 was a little high. Stands at his side. Give me his name. Cesare, head of the papal armies. What does he intend to do? Jar of leeches. What drives the man? That I still do not know. But Ezio, Cesare has set his sights on all of Italia, and at this rate he will have it. Is that that I hear treasure. Do you hear that? Voice? What's with him? What's he, doing? he knows how to exercise his will. A rare Wait! The world today. No! Wait! I gotta get this! Ah, ah, ah. I needed the treasure. There's so much stuff! I want it all! Shinies! By the way, when you collect most of those items, you can sell them for florins or trade more items for a weapon. Oh, okay. So yeah, one of the channel point things that I have on here is uh, is reverse. So I'd, Obviously that would not apply here. So if like I'm playing a first person shooter, and you're telling me, you know, you want to redeem reverse. For the next five minutes, I have to walk backwards <laughs> through the level. You know, whatever I'm doing. I can't walk backwards in this game, unfortunately. Should we not it doesn't always apply. Horse. you got to make sure you Roma read it before you click on these As things. Conquests in Romania continue to succeed or read the, the descriptions of them. Power, they have taken desirable areas of the city for themselves. We cannot use the stables here. Oh, the will of the Borgia is law now. What are you implying, Ezio? Do not play dumb with me, Machiavelli. Do you have some kind of plan? Thanks, Dark Side Girl. I have a lurk emote to start using soon. Still waiting for that to clear. All right, kill the Borgia captain. Gotcha. Okay, kill him to remove the Borgia influence over the area. Oh. Do I have to, like, stealth kill him, or do I just oh, run in there and kill him? I think I'm just going to kill him. 
Boom. I was going to let him get up, give him a fair fight. Kind of fun just fighting him the regular way. It's like a dance. But, uh. Am I supposed to, like. Do I just shoot him? <laughs> I'm not, nobody's really winning here, so what am I doing wrong? Grab him and throw him into the scaffold. I see. Stop it! No! Ugh. Ouch. How else can I kill him, though? Is that the only way? Because I could just fight him. But, like, that was going to take forever because nobody was... He wasn't really beating me. I wasn't really beating him. It was just stalemate. Could have kept spanning him, but it would take ages. I thought so. Okay. Very nice. We'll just do it this way then. Ouch. Sorry. You don't want a just piece of this. Just you kill a few guards does not mean the people will grant access to the That's an instant kill. Okay, cool. You are right. We need to send a signal. Wait here. Wait here, please. Ignite the Borgia Tower. I just came out of here. Okay, so I gotta go up there. Ah, oh, I remember these. This is cool. I remember this. Okay, okay. Let me go up here. Look at this. Go up here. Look at this. Climb up here. Even though I could use the ladder, but, you know, whatever. It's all the same. Let's see. This way. This way. I'm faster. Much more faster. All right, here we go. Ignite. Yeah! Woohoo! Fireworks! All right. It seems this table is now available for purchase. After you. It seems so. That's how we get stuff done. All right. For those immovably disabled, are asked not to take the ready before the door. Oh, I can renovate from here. Like in the last one. How do I do that, though? I gotta wait for the synchronization to end. Press Y to examine. There we go. Um, for zero? Of course. We like free stuff. The music does sound dramatic. I Oh, I love the theme to this game. Or to the Assassin's Creed games in general. Um... I like how it's evolved. The, like the main theme. Okay, company ham. Okay, except. Is he on horse? Yes, he is. Wait for me. Wait. Go slower, dude. I run over all these people. Watch out, guys. You're all in my way. Beep, beep. Got to put horns on these horses. The eye icon on database pop-ups indicates that something mysterious from Subject 16 may be located on the landmark. I intend Try to, to find it. Treat it Wait a minute. Stop sparring. What? Fine. Let us talk openly. Then. I have to go back and check Rodrigo that out. Rodrigo Borja's death would not have solved anything. <laughs> I am inclined to disagree. Look at this. Who is Subject 16? I'm, I'm confused. Borgia and Templar rule. Trying Even to figure out who that was. Will not change things. We need to take away the source of their power. Are you suggesting we appeal to the people? Maybe. Relying on the people. 
It's like building on the sand. You are wrong. Our belief in humanity rests at the heart of the Assassin Brotherhood. <laughs> hey, I suck. Thanks. You must be from your inner circle. Go. Get back what he has stolen. I will wait at the Campidoglio. I am meeting a contact there. Give me back my money. Well, thank you. Let's go catch the thief. Come back here. Anybody on YouTube who is wondering, why did I say I suck thanks? Talking to a little uh, a big possible nine-year-old on here. Who's that is? Tackle him! Yeah! Get down. What do I do? Is that it? Oh, all I have to do is tackle him. Full synchronization complete. Don't lose any health. Nice. You call yourself Romans! Alright, let's go back to this other location. We'll take care of these things over here. Move out of the way. Excuse me. Coming through. Coming through. Coming through. Michael, do me a favor. Do not acknowledge. What are you doing? Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Yeah, I'm going to need your help here, uh, Fire Expo. I need your help to show me how to do this. I need a master like yourself. But as I was saying earlier for Channel Point Redemptions, having a... Having stuff like, you know, challenges and stuff like what you were talking about earlier um, would be awesome. Especially if I could just... Okay, how do I get up there? Hang on a second. Let me look at the map. Okay, let's go. What is this location? Memory start central. To oh, okay. So really, I could go do anything now. And earlier, it was talking about an eyeball. Where is the eyeball? What's this? Something the Let's go up here. Let's go up here. I tried begging. Now take your time, Michael. Do what you gotta do. Let's go up here and sink this memory. I'm gonna climb up all the way. Why? Never Those are probably things I'm gonna do off stream though, like I did last time. Come on, climb up. Climb up! I'll go this way. I'm just going through a time. It's all right, fire. How are you doing? Otherwise. You want to talk about it? You can. Life is hard sometimes. Come on, climb up. What are you doing? You got to go around. Oh, so dumb. There we go. Press Y to synchronize. Nice. So I'm going to go through those after. I'm going to go through those after. Like, I'm done streaming. Because these, these eagle things, you know how it goes. They take forever. And I don't want to do that to you guys, so. I'll just skip them for now. See how much of the story I can do until then. See, I can't even unlock certain areas like that area right there. That sucks. So let's just go exploring a little bit. Moving on, moving on. So back to that fact that I had uh, stated about Mr. Uh, Leonardo. I'm going to go up here. The question to you is this. 
I gotta think of some. <laughs> so we were talking about how he used, to dig, he used to dig up bodies, which is crazy, right? Alright. Can I see it from here? Can I see it from here? It should be high enough to get to that exclamation point. Nope. Guess not. Hmm. I'm gonna climb to the top. There we go. I found the person I needed to find. And I'm gonna think of a question. <laughs> did you liberate your money from our friend? I did. A small victory. They are up. And in time, with work, we'll have a few dozen more. And in time, Cesare's gaze will return to us, and we'll be broken again. Now, where is my contact, Vinicio? He should have already intercepted the letter. Follow me. All right, except... Uh-oh. What did I click on over here? What happened? You know what really bugs me? Slow computers. Hang on a second. It's the worst. Oh my gosh. Okay. There we go. Give my best. All right, let's follow him. Crazy epic music, as usual. So the question for this particular episode Look at these is what is the craziest thing that you've had to do to find something that you lost? Have you ever been in a situation where you like lost a ring, you lost something, and you go digging through a dumpster? When did you become so cynical? I merely describe the reality of Roman today. But all may not be lost. The good news is that we have allies in the city. How much longer this will last, however, I cannot say. He was attempting to steal official Vatican mail. Perdonati, mi signore. You must be mistaken. Who are you working for, ladro? I am working for no one. Then no one will care what we do to you. Uh, okay. Am <laughs> I just beating you guys up? Is that what's happening here? Where is it? I guess so. The courier still has the letter. Ezio, stop him! Find me at the tournament! Alright, sorry, I keep... Stuff keeps popping up on my computer. I had to take care of it. Okay. I gotta chase and tackle this guy. Oh, I remember this whole area now. That's right. There's a lot of stuff that happens right here in this area. Oh, man. Oh, man. That was a nice escape. Nice, nice, nice. Nicely done. You got me good there. Let's see if I can catch him. And boom! Got him. Full synchronization complete. Uh, 
Alright, so... I got the Borgia letter. I received new emails. Leave the Animus to check your inbox. Ooh, how do I do that? Leave Animus, okay. Um, sure. Let's do it! Let's do it! We had a little troll here saying, Why do you even play and stream? You're not good! You're not good another for Twitch. Loser. <laughs> and then said, Sorry, just going through a tough time. So, we're going to send him a message. I want you guys to learn by example. Okay, this is how we deal with trolls. I'm going to send him a little whisper. Say, Hey. Thanks for hanging out. I am sorry you are going through it. Right? You're going through a tough time. If ever you want to talk about it, I'm here. Boom! It looks like he just created his account not too long ago, too. Late January. Which explains a lot. He's probably been banned before. But we fight hate with love. There's any way you can do Get it. Get up slowly. Get up slowly. Right. Um, I'm already up. So, what are we doing? You still managing the teams out in the field? No phone line. Rebecca's working on patching us into the network. So how's it feel letting the lady do all the work? She's no lady. Hey! <laughs> nice little dig at her. She's obviously pretty... masculine. Everything alright? I don't like being stuck underground with them out there looking for us. You're doing a great job. We're safe here. But for how long? Vidic won't give up. I know it. Neither will we. Those landmarks are the glyphs, says Michael earlier. Landmarks are the glyphs. Uh, I don't know. I'll wait till he comes back. Okay, what else do you have to we'll say? We'll talk later. Now get in there and find okay. the apple. We'll Not yet. I need to check email over here. There it is. The glowing computer. Don't you wish life were like that? Things were glowing. <laughs> this is what you need to do next. Whenever, like, your car breaks down or something, like, oh, look, all you have to do is click on the glowy parts. So we got a bunch of stuff going on here. Let's start from the bottom, I guess. Ooh, access denied. Okay. Of course. So I'm only going to be able to check my own, which makes sense. Why do they give me these options? I don't know, I guess it keeps it realistic. Right, so I just have one. Lucy Stillman, Desmond Miles, weekly schedule, end of session, everyone, supply run, Rebecca, clean up Lucy, Sean. Okay, so it's just a whole schedule. Mm -hmm. It's their Twitch streaming schedule. <laughs> Team breakfast, as prepared by Royal Chef Sean Hastings. Okay. Desmond is up to it, end of session. Okay, so it's nothing super importante. Okay, well, that was that was a thing. Let me go back and uh, go into the animus. Why do we have to stay down here all day? Abstergo's still looking for us. It'd be better if we never went out at all, but then we'd run out of supplies. It's like being in a cave during a rainstorm. Yeah, well, knowing the Templars, monsoon season's about to arrive. Okay. So, we back in the Animus. You're all set to go. Hang on, guys. I gotta do something real quick.
Okay. I had to rush that. <laughs> I randomly had all the coffee just go through me. I had to go. <laughs> uh, yeah, so that happened. I'm okay now. Alright, so let's go to the next place. Whoa! What is this? How do I even get down? No hay stacks anywhere. There's one right there. I don't need that one. How do you get down? Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. You just, you just fell right off. I was trying to grab the ledge, and he just <laughs> flew off. Well, that happened. There's an old saying, hurt people. Ah, most impressive. Hurt people. Is to clear the guard. Meaning that if someone's hurting, they're going to come cause trouble and hurt you back. Or not hurt you back, but just hurt you just because they're hurting. Hurt people will hurt people. So that's the whole thing. Or misery loves company. It's all the same type of, same type of stuff. Come on, get down. Come on. Okay, all right. I'm gonna go the long way. <laughs> Trying to take shortcuts. He, he didn't grab on anything. Whatever. Dumbest death. So anyway, and so... If you go back through any of the trolls we've ever encountered, they're just people. You know? And if you're happy, you're not gonna go out and do stuff like that. Usually it's because you're miserable. I like that I started down here, though. That was kind of nice. Look at this. Very nice. Um, let's look at the map. How many things do I have to do? Wow. So these are all the... These are towers. It's a thieves guild. I don't understand... What's this? Oh... Viewpoint. Huh. What's that? Tunnel entrance. Open aqueduct. So there's a lot to do. It's gonna it's gonna be another long journey. I know I could probably have a horse, but I'm enjoying just running through. You never know what I'd... Horses are just too fast sometimes. Now, if it were further than a couple hundred meters or whatever, then I would take the horse. Oh, I guess I gotta go up here. So anyway, you go back through all the all the trolls and stuff, and just people, you know, when somebody's driving, they got road rage and they flip you off. Those people are not happy. They're hurting. That's how it works. And it took me so long to realize this. Because, they, you know, I'm just too busy being pissed off at them for acting the way they were. But, I don't know, it just comes with age, maturity. Deliver the letter. Okay. So we go back here, for example. Oh, hang on. Cutscene, cutscene, cutscene. Ah! No, it was about... It was about right, Michael. This is, actually, I thought it was less than 20 minutes. Ouch. So we're just talking about trolls, Michael, and uh, come from? 
I'm gonna assume it's a kid that came on earlier, but I was just saying that like hurt people. My brother-in-law was the first one to say this. Hurt people will hurt people. Must have come from in here. Oh, don't lose any health. I see. So you get you get a certain amount of synchronization depending on how well you do. That that's a whole nother thing. Um Imagine if this wasn't Assassin's Creed it would be called Hooded Man Kills Wolf Furries. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pretty much. And so the person came on here. I'll end it with this. They said, uh, you know, why do you suck? Why do you even play streams? You're not that good. All this stuff. And then when you answer with, with, with love and caring and kindness, you'll be amazed what happens. So in that situation, I was like, hey, you got to teach me. Like, it's probably really good. And that's not the answer the person was expecting. Or maybe even wanting. After that, all of a sudden, it's like, sorry, just going through a tough time. So now they apologize. You see, moral of the story, fight hate with love. Locate the shrine to Romulus. And no, I wasn't talking about that the whole time, in case you were wondering, Michael. <laughs> I just brought it up again recently. Um, I just thought it was an important lesson to learn for people. Yeah, he's probably nine. You could tell, too, like... But there are legitimately, which is even more sad, there's, there's other people that are like full-grown adults that are like that. Like the saying goes, hurt people will hurt people. Hurt people hurt people. That's just how it is. It's very sad. You know, you just gotta feel, feel bad for them. Help them out. What's that? Ooh, that's what I need. It's a lever. It's a lever! I figured out my question finally after talking about digging up the, the graves. The question was, uh. Damn, what the hell did I ask? Oh! It was. Have you ever. Like, what was the craziest thing you've had to do to find something? You know, whether it be flipping over couches because you can't find your lucky quarter, or digging through a dumpster because you lost a ring. Who knows? Like. <laughs> wading through sewage to find something. You ever lost something you had to go crazy looking for? It's the only thing I could think of asking since, uh, talking about Leonardo's strange escapades as a grave digger. <laughs> in real life. In real life. Michael says, by the way, if you do all six some of those Liars can get the armor of Romulus. You mean? You didn't mean to say liars. Oh, I was gonna ask you since you're back. I just remembered. Oh, there's no map. On the map, there's all these um things to light on fire. Remember this? There's um you know like the towers and stuff. You were talking about finding all of the glyphs. What are the glyphs? Are they? The towers? Oh! Man! I just fell all the way down. You gotta be kidding me. Do this again. Hang on. Oh! Oh, the pain! Okay, so I have to start from this one. No matter what. There we go! <laughs> I didn't have to go all the way around after all. Let's see. There. Those are those eye thingies. Okay, so I haven't found the eye thingies yet, I don't think. I like every memorable building there should be one. Okay, cool. I know what to look for now. Thanks! I got my own personal little Assassin's Creed guide. It seems like one of you guys are always a guide for one of these games. Which is nice to have around. Always like to hang out with an expert in there fields because okay I'm gonna have to go this way Oop. just makes life easier it's not about what you know it's about who you know and I know people that know lots of what <laughs> use eagle vision when near one gotcha and I'm like the Wikipedia of Assassin's Creed that's that's good to know I'll call you the Michaelpedia
Micopedia. I've had some uh, Fallout people too. That was the first game that I was streaming, Fallout New Vegas, which I have not played in a long time. I have to get back to that. Oh! I'm assuming that they were assuming that I was just another piece of rubble, which is probably good. I see that switch over there. How am I going to get this Nintendo Switch? I guess I have to climb. Can't even get up there. I guess I just go this way for now. Go to the gate that's open, yeah. I just wanted to see if there was other stuff I can do. I don't know. Like I said, I'm not a completionist, naturally, but sometimes I like to get little extra things like that. As long as not, I'm not spending hours doing it, you know? If it's like right around the corner, or it's like some little room or something, I'll get it. But, and it's not because I don't want to be a completionist, it's just because I don't want to be a completionist. <laughs> it's, it's just me, like... I just feel like there's so many stories to be told, so many games to be played. And I only have one life to live. So I figured if I want to be an actual gamer and experience all these games, I'm probably... That's my hobby. I'm probably going to want to uh, not spend a month per game. <laughs> or weeks per game. So I'm trying trying to get through them. But I also don't want to like rush rush. Because I understand that that could take away from the experience as well. So it's a nice balance. So I have to climb this, obviously. Whether it's short? Mm. Like I said, I've played this before. I just don't remember that well. I have a wee bit of brain damage. Long story. I don't think I do anymore, but... I made some bad choices in life. I'm back now. I'm back and better than ever, but... You know. Not quite as sharp as I was when I was, say, 14. I was a gamer then. If I were to game against my younger self, I would lose every time. Sometimes I have my moments where I still got it. But those are far and few between. So Michael says, like Ezio, but your home doesn't get raided with cannons. <laughs> Um, okay. So this way. This way. This way. Get the secret. See, there's another secret I found. Because I was supposed to go forward over the fire. Figured there might be something back here. Okay, now I can go that way. Um, whoop! Oh! Is the statue gonna fall? Is it gonna fall? Nope. I thought it was going to fall and lean into these rocks I'm supposed to be climbing on. <gasps> that was close. I pressed the wrong button. Okay. Um. Um. Oh, am I going to make that? That's crazy. Oh, I did. How? Okay, he's pointing that way. That's a nice little touch. <laughs> it's cool. Ever seen your sister make a brothel in home? Nope. Ezio did. <laughs> I'm digging Michael's personality. Just so you guys know. He's new here, but like... Funny dude. Sounds a lot like stuff I would say. <laughs> Especially those uh, names you came up with. The little... Risque name... Puns and wordplay. <laughs> I noticed you changed it again on Discord. Good stuff. Pushing the limits, but it's all in fun. Unfortunately, with Twitch, a lot of stuff I can't repeat. Because they would think I'm things that I'm not. Oh. 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 Gotta, we gotta obey the man around here. 
Twitch being the man. How do I get up there? Can I climb this? Nope. Hmm. Don't you love politics? Don't you love censorship? I can't even have a little bit of fun without getting in trouble, man. Different times. How do I go over there? What do I do? See, that one's gonna bug me, because, like, <laughs> I really want to get up there. Let's see. Okay. I'm sorry, am I being timed? That sure sounds like I'm being timed. Oh, full synchronization failed. Okay, so I'm being timed, but I don't need the full synchronizations. I just want to get through the story. Tell me, is full synchronization going to get me anything? Because if so, I'm going to restart it. If you get... Ah, yes, amazing. <laughs> if you get all 101 flags or fully rebuild, your, rebuild Rome, you can get the bird flag. Tell me about the full synchronization. <clears throat> no, full sync does not. I see. Well, then, it's just another flex. Okay. Um... I go this way. I'm gonna have to climb this probably. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Um I don't see a way up. I don't see a way up. I'm gonna have to go this way. And shimmy along. Oh no wait, I could just go over. Never mind. Did I come from here? I did. I need to go that way. Can I can I climb? Can I shimmy? Okay. What am I doing wrong? How about up here? What's up here? There we go. Is this new? No. Nope. I came from here. I was going the right way. I was going the right way. Stop. 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 Go that way. Oh, I thought that was a secret. Not a secret. I'm gonna go back up here. I feel like I've come from here too. I did. Maybe not. Oh, oh, oh. Now we're good. It's just a long little parkour detour. Now I can get back up here. What's this? Oh, that's the whisper I sent that dude. <laughs> I mean, I assume it's a dude. Maybe not. Whatever it was. It's gone now. Be interested to see if uh, I get my message or not. <laughs> Wait! How do I get that? Oh, I gotta turn around. No doing that. How do I get that? See, that's gonna bug me. It's like right there. Nope, not doing it. Don't care. Move on. Don't need it. Super enticing, though. Hmm. Hmm. What's that this? Hmm. So much stuff to look at, but there's not really many items to pick up in Assassin's Creed. Alright, so I'm gonna need to climb on one of these, I think. All right? Wait a minute. How do I do this? Let's see. Go over here. Climb on this. Um, it's way above me, huh? You can redo these anytime so you can get them when you want. Get what? The full synchronizations? But I don't need them though, right? Or you're talking about getting the, the treasure things. Oh, 
such scary climbing. It's over there. I need to be going this way though. I don't think I can reach that. Let's go this way first. Oh! Ah! Uh. Yeah! I need to go this way. I wasn't sure I'd make that jump. Or all the chests or whatever. Gotcha. That could help if I fall. Go this way. Whoop. And whoop. And whoop. That could help if I fall. Oh no, I probably offended somebody with that accent. Listen, man. Just having fun. We are just all having fun. Ah. Uh, almost died. Uh. Woo! I mean, what even are you, Ezio? What, what is this nonsense? I route up if I fall. You are. A brave soul. Oh. Oh. How do I get over there? Like this. Oh. So much climbing. Okay. I think I made it now. Nice. When collecting also six keys, you get the armor of Brutus, not Romulus. That makes more sense. The armor of Brutus. I'm sure they got some cool ones in here. How many of these are there? So many. Well, that's good. That makes me feel better for missing that one chest. I got like seven. ladder. I'm guessing that's the way out. Let's do this first. Scroll of Romulus. Oh, it is Romulus. I leave my family's armor here, one of the finest sets ever made. May you who find it receive strength in battle. Change of handwriting. We've taken it and set it back behind the iron door. Six keys unlock it, spread amongst our brothers. It shall be said to come from Romulus, and they will worship it. Zoom to see image data. Oh! Dude, that's awesome! Like, it almost looks like that's something you legitimately would see. Like a historical artifact. Unless that is a picture of something. I wouldn't know. I know my history, but I'm not, I don't know my history, like, know my history. I'm just an average Joe when it comes to history. Except not Joe. That's, that's not my name. That's not my name. That's not my name. Remember that song? That was a thing for a while. Super cheerleadery. Kind of liked it. I kind of dug it. What's the next, man? What's the next? The followers of Romulus. This band of false pagans has been terrorizing the city for months and driving the people into the arms of the church. Quite convenient. Exactly. I believe the Borgia are supporting them, but proof remains scarce. That is why the letter is so important. Here it is. I hope you can break a cipher. Cazzo. Another encryption. This one was supposed ah, to... Ah, now we know how to say that in Italian. They are transmitting <laughs> them using a code sheet. Without it, we have nothing. Sometimes logic is not the only way to win a war. Also the, the dagger... You said we had allies in the city. The game. Bring me to them. Gotcha. Follow me. Michael with the drop in the knowledge. Saying that the Brutus armor is very big and bulky. Hello, Machiavelli. What's this? 
Oh, I'll come deal with these later. These are things I can upgrade. I remember now, I liked this system of upgrading better than the, the one in the other game that we just finished. Is this where we're going? Or is this a secret? Super secret secret. It's one of those um, tombs, right? Temples? We recently began traveling through the tunnels to avoid the guards, but many of the entrances in the city are broken. By using them, we can get to our destination rapidly without encountering resistance. Oh, heck yeah. Sweet. Enter the tunnels. Don't mind if I do. Uh, there we go. Right. This takes me anywhere I need to go. I need to go there. Borgia Cape puts all recognition from guards permanently zero, says Michael. Nice. So that's a lot like what they started doing in the last game. Guys, what kind of chat overlay do you want? This weekend I want to work on an overlay. I really want to, I'm going to put a... I don't want to take up too much of the screen, though. I'm not into that. I like showcasing the games. A pleasure. But I want it to be, like, readable. I've heard a great deal about you from my cousin, Bartolomeo Gaziano. Different ones. A fine warrior. Fabio has lent us in a new storeroom on Isola Tiberina. I know you were used to better accommodations in Toscana. It is perfect. Bene. Then I am off to begin preparations for Romagna. Today, Cesare commands my men, but soon I hope we will be free. Now I propose we begin planning our assault on the Borgia. Oh, you think we are ready for such an attack? See, si. Do you know, for instance, where the Borgia troops took Caterina Sforza? What? Are you also unaware that the Borgia have captured the Apple of Eden? How could we have lost the Apple? So, you do not know what goes on with our enemies. Do we at least have an underground here to work with? Hardly. Our mercenaries are ensnared in a losing battle with Cesare's French allies. We have girls. It's Cesare. That's how you pronounce it. It's not Cesare. <laughs> Cesare. But the madam there is lazy and would rather attend parties than further our cause. What about the city's thieves? Do they have a guild? See, si, but they refuse to talk to us. I don't know why. What are you going to do? Make some friends. Sounds good. I'm gonna make some friends. So this is my base. Ah, uh, it's all coming back to me now. It's all coming back to me. So Michael's saying it's like the auditory cape from Assassin's Creed 2. Fight of the Lover and the Thief, Sequence 3. Perfect time to stop for our final break. Thanks so much for hanging out, guys. This has been fantastic. What is your deal? Oh. Just, uh, begging for, for money. I'm going to leave it right here, guys. I will be back shortly. And uh, it's telling me to leave the Ennis, so I'll do that as soon as I get back. Hang tight. Okay, okay, okay. I am back. One last hour. Let's see. <laughs> so, Leonardo Da Vinci had no relationships with women. He never married and had no children. Indeed, he wrote in his notebooks that male-female intercourse disgusted him. Random fact about Da Vinci. 
<laughs> no idea what kind of question is going to go along with that, so I'll just probably ask something random. <laughs> and I saw that, Michael, earlier. Time to make a mint. So got that PTSD going, huh? <laughs> From that game. Okay, Welcome let's... back, Desmond. I like that backpack. So the graphics are like a little bit better, like each time, which is really cool. I like watching it kind of grow and evolve. Let's see what. I'm assuming I need to check my email or something, right? Is that what's going on here? Let's see. Yep. We have. Let's see what's deleted. Is that the one from before? Yes. Okay. Let's go to this inbox MP3 player. Hey guys, can't find my MP3 player. The little black one. Let me know if you see it. Trouble sleeping without my tunes, Rebecca. Make sure you stay in the loop. Guy Fox, Snowman, Ju oh, look at that! Boom! Guy Fox. That is kind of a funny name. <laughs> Inbox. Got, we got a lot of stuff going on. Okay, so this is gonna be this is gonna be a whole thing. So we're gonna go in order from oldest to newest. Desmond, I did hear it, but there's not much we can do until we've reached our goal. I know it's awful and I hate doing this to him, but it's necessary. We're just gonna do all inboxes and outboxes, it'll come together as we read them. I had two yogurts in the mini fridge as of this morning and now they're gone. I'm hungry and annoyed, so who took them? Oh, they're, you know, they're all emailing each other and they're standing right next to each other. Think about it. <laughs> I'm supremely disappointed that you would make such allegations of your dedicated staff. This accusation is unjust, unfounded, and frankly rather insulting. And that's Sean. Thanks, Becca. Sean, you're on cleanup for the next week. Rebecca is a Templar. This just in. Found it! Okay. Desmond was screaming pretty loud in sleep yesterday. It's getting worse. I don't know if you heard it too, but I thought I'd let you know. You ate both of them. I know because he asked me if I wanted one. <laughs> hey guys, can't find the MP3 player. Okay, that's the one that I got. Cool. Let's go to the next one. Armcore! Desmond casually hacks his friend's email. Yeah. When you flip pages in your email, it kind of sounds like the FNAF camera. It does a little bit. Here's the thing though. Um, I don't think he hacked it, right? Hang on. Desmond got this information from... Oh, I guess so, huh? Because it wasn't them. Alright, I see what you mean. Alright, so. Two yogurts. Sean ate them both. Gonna clean up. MP3 player. So the outbox. Okay. Got it. And the last one should probably have some new information in it. Sean B. Mad is pretty funny slash annoying. Okay, screaming, the yogurt, more yogurt, Templars, MP3 player, weekly schedule. Desmond, I did hear it, but there's not much we can do until we reached our goal. I know it's awful and I hate doing this to him, but it's necessary. I'm talking about me screaming. Two yogurts in the mini fridge. Okay. All right. That uh, told me nothing. I'm sure that'll change later on. No! Get out of the email. I don't want the email anymore. Let's You're all set to go. <clears throat> she looks like Kristen Bell. The series is so much more different than I thought it'd be. I told you, Normcore. It's really good. It's really good. I don't think it's for you, but it is really good. You missed the end of the last one. There, there's like legit friggin' gods and aliens or something. It's a whole thing. It's not even just a historical... It's it's sci-fi, too. We're going back and forth between modern time and... Okay. Um, and, and it's so frustrating. Like, it's a pet peeve of mine. I like to do things in order. And there's so many people that just casually play, like, the newest, hottest, whatever game. And they missed all the other ones. I'm like, no! What are you doing? Uh, I do need armor, or weapons, or both. So I'll just upgrade one of those things, see what kind of weapons they got in here. Nah, I'm going to save up a little more. I don't have... Stop it! Go away! 
I don't have the um, money for. I want to get like a really, really nice whip on. Oh no! Water! Oh! Nice to save there. And where's the next place we're going? I'm going to stick with 2D platformers. Yeah, I figured. You probably should. That's your thing. Ooh, wait a minute. What's that? What are these treasures? I'm going to go get that. Um. Yeah, that's what I was telling you the other day. You and Steph were like, ah, get off there. See, that, that's kind of the clunky stuff he still does a little bit. Not as bad, but he still does it. Um, you guys were talking about how, like, everyone says, Oh, we're, are you a variety streamer? <laughs> I'm not picking on you. It's just that um, I was trying to let you know that, like, you have a, a niche that you're really good at. How do I get up there? This way. And um, you might have variety within your Nintendo-esque games, but you're not like super variety variety. I'm pretty variety. I'm playing things that like one day could be FNAF, one day could be Pokemon, one day could be uh, Resident Evil. <laughs> Just whatever, man. Whatever. How do I get over there? Well, now I have a whole new thing. Now I want to kill this guy. Can I go this way? Nice. Hang on a second. Michael says, I only like first one. The Ezio Trilogy. And Black Flag. You don't like the others? Physics have left the chat. <laughs> yeah, I know, I know. Man bumps away from the bench. I was half in water. Bench PTSD. Normcore Gaming. Yeah, it's a good point. I mean, we do play Halo Weekly right now. We'll probably do some other games like that. We could be a little more specific when we're talking about what we do for sure. I mean, you know, it's just whatever. Sometimes when I when I explain something, it doesn't come out as comes out more as a. Like a critique when I'm trying to compliment. You know what I mean. You've known me enough to know. But it's just something a lot of people do. They're like, oh, we're variety. I'm like, you're not variety. Brag about what you're good at. Ouch! And and Eddie, if you haven't followed him already, Michael. Normcore Gaming is my... Okay, okay, that's enough. Normcore is my um, brother-in-law and my sister. And usually if you see Normcore in the chat, it's it's my brother-in-law. My sister uses the Steph Babies account. Okay, so do I just go down here, I guess? I'm a little bit... A little bit lost. I remember there's something that... I know it's supposed to be stealth, but I'm kind of enjoying killing everybody here. Ouch! 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 No! Ouch! 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 Um, go back below? Okay. I was like digging fighting people. I'm trying to get better at the fighting mechanics um, I'm learning more as I go so now I know that the spear dudes just like in the first game very much are harder to block and especially the big dudes you gotta you gotta kick them to break their defenses first bye oh he lived I think he lived All right, let's kill everybody. A 
fighting is a lot easier, I must say. Especially since you can get a combo going. Assassin's Creed is a thing that big boys are hard to fight. Yeah, well, it makes sense. I mean, in real life, big boys are hard to fight. For the most part. Unless they're just... Not fighters. <laughs> if it's a big boy non-fighter, they're pretty easy to fight. But yeah. I don't mind. Let's see. It's down here. Bye. See, now I can kill them all, I bet you. Yep. Love it. Love it. Love it. So good. Now here's the dude I need to kill. Looks like we will not be hung for this earth. Okay, let's see. What else do I need to do? Go down further. Oh, can't go that way. Dead end. treasure go back to the big pot place oh big pit place hang on make sure my screen saver doesn't come on I still uh, I gotta make a mental note to actually prevent that from happening unless I said it because I was doing that last night I wasn't too happy about it I'm not really looking for where I'm going. I'm just kind of fighting people now. Just for a little bit. I guess if I were looking for it, it's going to be that yellow thing, right? So this is the entrance. I'm probably going to have to go down as far as I can go. So let's go down as far as I can go. Which would be... Here. Then I can't go down any further. So... See, let's go this way. Go down a little more. And I'm getting close. There we go. There we go. It's up here. Where you started running down. Oh, I'm already. I think this is it. Yep. I found the treasure. How do I get in? Press B. Recover all the keys from the scrolls of running the center at the gate. <gasps> oh! Well, shoot. That's a thing. Okie dokens. I'm assuming I get that later, right? Let's just get out of here now. That's some Metal Gear sneaky music going on here. How do I get back up? She's got some good fashion, says Nemi. <laughs> yeah, I enjoy it. It's pretty badass. I like the color scheme. The the white and red's probably my probably my favorite one. But some of them look. It just depends, like on the on my mood. I really do like the white and red though. Oh, black and red's really cool too. I dig black and red. All right, so where do I go next? What do, what do I do? Since that was a discovery I just made, I can't really do yet. Let's see. Ignite the Borgia Tower. What do the towers do for me? This is a thing to do. This is a thing to do up here. This is a thing to do over here. 
I guess I'll go after the tower first. I'm right here. And then I'll go do my next thingy. Towers make renovating the shop. Oh, I see. That's what men really want to wear, says Nemi. <laughs> Welcome to the 1500s in Assassin's Creed. <laughs> you want to be dressed when you go get groceries? <laughs> hey. Just make sure you film it. I want to see what happens. Okay, if I gotta ignite that, right? Let's see what you mean. So it makes a renovating shop, or like it allows me to... Is that what you're saying? Let's see. I get up there. Oh, man. Oh, man. Try the other way. If not igniting the tower, you can rebuild the shops. Honestly, in California, I wouldn't even be the weirdest looking dude. Yeah, you're in California too? I mean, it, it depends on where in California, but yeah. If you're like in one of the bigger cities, <laughs> which I am not, then yeah. <laughs> You'd fit right in. <laughs> okay, so I have to... So I don't have to spend the florins if I if I do it like this, and that's what you're saying, right? Oh, you're between major cities? Nemi? Come on! What is this all about? Get over there. Climbing is hard. Ugh. Ugh. I don't have my jump ability. That makes it hard. Let's try this. Nope, can't do that. Let's go up here. I definitely want to get up there. I think I can. It's just, it's just a task. It's so tedious to climb compared to the second game. Some of these are like a little bit tricky. It's definitely doable. It just takes forever. There's that crazy backwards jump. Awesome. I'm going to catch up on chat. What am I going to do, guys, when chat gets all crazy and I can't keep up with it? What do I do? Allows you to renovate shops. I'm playing a building. 20 minute floor and I'm not getting increases. I'm like, okay, climbing is hard. <laughs> climbing towers after revelations is easy. So there's one more. Revelations is the last one, right? It's the one after this, like the last in the Ezio trilogy or whatever. I don't know anything about Assassin's Creed after this. This is as far as I've ever gotten. I'm, I'm so excited to get to the next ones. Look, there's another wolf head. What am I doing? There's so many things to do. It's on oh, my brain. My brain. Rome 1% rebuilt. So by doing this... I now have like things like oh whatever. and I have things that I can rebuild in here is that what's going on I remember there being one down here somewhere I love how the guards don't even care about a tower being on fire yeah yeah Tio dies after that basically yeah it's because he's I think it like jumps into the future doesn't it well don't tell me but I'm, I'm pretty sure especially because it hinted at that right now with Desmond seeing him so all these things I can rebuild, like that there in the in the horizons. Let's see, here's a doctor. Oh, this is a thing to rebuild, right? How do I? How do I do? How do I Assassin's Creed? There it is. Buy this landmark for wow. I don't have nearly enough money for that nonsense. I'll do that eventually. So what's this wolfy thing over here? See a wolfy thing. You're excited to get we we'll get so much Japanese candy right now? You seriously? Where are you gonna get it? I want some. I don't think I've ever really tried Japanese candy. Let me think. I mean I might recognize some, but I don't think I have. 
believe it or not. Yeah, the Asian market. Well, I thought you were going to like some special. I don't know where you live, so. For all I know, it could have been like some uh, world renowned Asian market. Does sound interesting, right? You're gonna get cream filled cookies, gourmet. Oh, yeah, yeah, I have then. I'd have. Now that I know what kind of candy. Yeah. Gourmet Kit Kats, rice dough filled with fruit jelly. I haven't had that one. Or the gourmet Kit Kats. I've had the cream filled cookies, they're pretty good. I haven't had them, for, I think, maybe once or twice. That's it. All right. Thrown into the wolves. Find the shrine to run with. So, oh. If I don't lose three blocks of health, I get, like, some special extra synchronization stuff. But I'm not worried about that. Because Michael here has told me that it's not super important. It just gives you flexing stuff and whatever, so I'm good. Assuming if I go over here, I can get this extra secret shiny. Right. Right. Yeah. Uh oh. Got stuck down here. Purple yam, taro. Ube is one of my favorite flavors, and I'm looking for as much of that as I can. You're making me hungry now. Not for candy, but just talking about food now. It's like... I heard another super secret shiny. Did you hear it? You hear that? Where is it? Super secret shiny! Yes! Mm. Oh. Oh. Okay. Climb up here. So I need to go that way. And the only way that way is probably around that way. <laughs> Got to go around the long way, of course. Let's see. Mm. Wait a minute. I need it. I need to figure out. Where do I go? Climb back on that thing. Oh well, yeah. Let's see, so I have to go over that. I was going the right way, I think. Let me see. Can't do that. Okay, let's go this way. Oh, there we go. I got it. Boom. What's the down here? Hello. Oh. Is my sound synced up? Ready? I'm gonna make a jump sound. One, two. Oh. Should have been the second I jumped. If it's delayed, that's gonna make me mad. Because a lot of times it gets delayed by like a second or two. Which is fine, but when like I play horror games, if I accidentally scream, it should be synced. Are you alive? Like delay. Nah. I gotta figure that out. Suffer as we must suffer. How about now? Ready? One, two. Yeah. One. Stop it. One, two, three. One, two. I should have fixed it. Okay, now I'm going to fight them. Boom. Slice. Poke. And pop. Okay, maybe the sound delay should not be bad now. Try something. Your death is written, assassin. Setting the lower delay. The, the delay. Gotcha. You know I know you receive and cipher letters from them. All right. Prove your innocence. Tell me where the code sheet is hidden. Oh, okay. Never. Cool. Thanks.
I'm actually streaming this one right here on, on the Xbox. I haven't even set up the other thing yet. I was going to do that this weekend. But that's good uh, info to know. Like, I need to learn how to do all that stuff. All of it. I can't know to do any of it. I can't know to do it. But there was a time where I was actually good at computers. Before I wasn't. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, crap. Ah, oh, crap. I had, like, emulators. I was doing stuff. Now I'm like, how do I, how do I, what do I click on? What's this? <laughs> Why are these pop-ups happening? Okay, so this is a simple chase sequence that we do all the time. Ah! Which one is? It is... Whatever one's up here. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Oh. So right now on the Xbox, someone told me a trick, like if you unplug, I have a headset plugged into the controller for this, um, right now. Hang on. Where's this trail go? There he is. Nope, that's fire. <laughs> Dudes, where'd he go? in here somewhere um and so someone taught me a cool trick you can actually unplug the slide of boomers I'm not old get a blade combat's easier now you don't have to perfectly time it yes I agree I've been googling my way through most issues <laughs> yeah now I hear you Emmy. Uh, so someone taught me a cool trick you could actually unplug the controller I mean unplug your your auxiliary jack for the headphones from your controller, plug it back in, and it usually fixes the delay. Xbox has a weird thing like that. Uh, just kind of, just kind of does that. Okay, so maybe go this way. Nope. Okay, so that's where he was. Let me follow this again. I seem to have lost him. What the? What the? What the? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? How you be so sneaky? Come out of my way! Oh. Okay, so I'm just guessing somehow he. What? No! Never. Oh man! Get back up there again. Sucks. What's he up to? Why would anyone carry on like that? Cause I wanna. Dudes, what? What the heck? How can I not find this guy? He following the path to the parkour and then do the parkour. That's what I'm trying to do. Is it? Okay, let me see. Maybe I can't do it from here. How about down here? Nope. This is the right way. I'm gonna do it from this side. Are you in here? Is that you? Nope, but it's treasure. I'll take the treasure. All right, let's go back to the eagle vision. See what's going on. I'ma do it. I'ma do an age reveal soon. You can kind of figure out age based off of Normcore. Like I said, if you haven't followed her already, her and my brother-in-law. My sister Stephanie is part of Normcore. Okay, Michael's back. He's gonna guide me through. Go into the second room. So I'm assuming this is the first room. Right. I don't know what you mean by second room. Don't be bashful time, is it? Ooh, look. So this is, this is back to where I was. So I am going in a circle. This is where I was, right here. First room where I came from. Huh. Huh. See, his path is gone. So I don't understand. Oh, there he is, son of a... Are you serious? This whole time? 
This whole freaking time, I was right on top of him. That was dumb. This whole time! Like compilation video of confusion is on the way. I was right there too. How stupid is that? <laughs> the whole time I was right there. I can't get over that. That was so ridiculous. Oh man. Get out of the way. What? What are you doing even? What was that? What was that? Okay, I'm, I'm just gonna let it start over. That was bull. What was that even? Why did you jump off your horse? I didn't tell you to jump off your horse. You knew the path, but you forgot the room. Yeah, I, I don't know. That was weird. I, I didn't have that problem the first time I played this. Like I said, I'm just getting kind of worse. <laughs> It's alright. It's all good. I did it. Because obviously I didn't have stream to help me before. And I did it. So. I probably just got lucky and found him like I did that time. I don't know. For, to me, the path did not seem as clear. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Alright, alright. Don't you start. What is that? What is that even? Why are you doing that? Don't be weird, Ezio and your horse. Work with me here. It's because I think I'm holding A to do, like, the free running. That's what it is. Hey, hey. So sometimes he, like, the game thinks I want to jump off or something. That is not what I want to do, game. That is not what I want to do. So that way I can move the camera around, you know? Horse assassination. Right trigger and press X. Ah, nice. That was, that was badass. That was cool. Nice. Horse riding in AC is bad. Yeah, it's a little clunky, that's to say the least. That looks like horse NSFW. <laughs> oh, whatever. It's behind us. Doing this. Jumping over here. Okay, whoa. Jump! So that took a little longer than expected. But that's a typical slight stream for you. <gasps> oh, so lucky. You ever just fall into a deep abyss and find a treasure? Happens to me every Tuesday. Checkpoint reached. Cool. It's pretty nice down here. It's a little dark. Can't see much. White hooded man kills men in wolf costume. That's a headline, for sure. Uh, let's get some of these. And let's get some of these over here. to see if I can draw my sword fast. You cannot. If I can master some of those basic mechanics, fighting will not be a problem. <laughs> like, if I have my sword out, I'll just be like, pow! You would think that as soon as they're fighting you, like, he would just instantly draw his sword as soon as you press the attack button, but he doesn't. He takes his sword out, he doesn't draw it to attack. I feel like you should instantly attack, because, I mean, he's an assassin, right? You should be badass like that. It's weird how this game's supposed to be bad. It was made in nine months. 
AC took AC two took two years. I know that they, they saw how well the first two games did and like any other companies they're like, Oh, we're gonna we're gonna bust this out. It's not really a bad game though. Like I guess I'm not spoiled, I'm not like desensitized to amazing games yet. Because uh, I went away for so long from gaming. So to me, every game's a good game. Like, so far, this is fantastic. Mm. Let's take a look. So, I don't need to get all of these. But I'm going to probably do it off stream, as I said before. It's a lot of work. It's a lot of grind, as they say. Uh, so, yeah, it's not something I'm going to bore you with on stream. I think I'll just do it. I'll do these things, though. This one and this one. They seem fun. That's his hideout. Nice. Okay. So let's go. Uh, where am I right now? I lost my place. I'm just going to head to, I think this one's closer, I believe. That's pretty far. That doesn't matter. I'm going to do it anyway. Why? Because why not? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, I'm looking at chat. Sorry. If you're me, I did some weird stuff like in the middle of the fight. Shoot someone. Seals the imposter? Uh, this one. Saw him vent. Oof. That's another game I haven't played. I know what you're talking about, what you're referring to. I get the joke. But I've also not played um, Among Us. I know the game, alright. I don't really know exactly how it works, but I've seen it played a little bit. So many games I've never played before. Here's a nice wide open area. While I'm running, I can look over here at chat. The orange one is where you can find the armor. Yeah. Talk a person with a great thing above their head for money. Press Y so you can summon the horse. Oh, that's right. On this one, I can do this. Oh. I like how you said Y. You, you made a note. Good for you, sir. You made a mental yeah. note of... Okay, I'm gonna go this way, because I was already headed that way. You made a mental note of what, uh... Which console I was playing. Very observant. Very kind. You could have said triangle, though, and I would have under understood what you meant. Triangle. Why? I don't know what to be on keyboard. I, I don't really ever play games on a computer. And if I do, I plug in a... When I play them, I plug in a controller. It's up here. I thought I saw something shiny. No? Nope. So there's a tower over there. There's a tower over there. A tower way over there. So many places to go. Right, let's try this again. Yeah! <laughs> Summoning the horse. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? There he is. There's the babies. Oh! Oh! Yeah. Uh, it's called bad controls. I'm gonna blame the controls for now. See, the horse comes in handy when, when things are far away. I want to get out of this place. Let me out. Ugh. Okay, maybe I can go. There we go. There we go. Open fields. Oh. Okay, wait a minute. I'm going to pick one. Let's see, this is the closest. That's where I was trying to go. Rome looks so huge, but it's very small after you play this a lot. 
It does look kind of Oh, treasure. Let me get that, please. Thank you. So we're going to have to end the stream here. I'm going to go do this one thing. And I'll do a whole bunch of off-stream stuff. And then I'll jump back in this again in a couple days. But you will see me again tonight, possibly, for another bonus stream of Grim Fandango, so I can just get that done before March. If you want to know what I'm going to be playing in March? Um, I'm going to compile a list and tweet it. It will be on Twitter. Well, aren't you special? Really special. And I might have some channel point redemptions or something where you guys can suggest a game to me or something. This is all this is all in the works. I'm I'm trying to figure stuff out. <laughs> Most entertaining. If it's a game, I'm gonna get to it though. I'm, I'm just gonna have a probably priority. You know, some games over others, but I'll get there. And I can go this way. Don't be a Minecraft YouTuber where you're grinding off camera and are at the end. <laughs> no, I did this for Assassin's Creed 2. When I mean grinding off camera, which I hardly ever do, almost everything now that I play is streamed. I mean getting these. All these little things. All these little things that, you know, you're not going to... You know how long this would take me to do? That would take up the whole stream. If you're cool with that, if you're cool with just watching me get every single viewpoint... But all the other stuff, I do on the street. Let's go in here. Here we go. Welcome to the Rosa in Fiore, stranger. Well, thank you. Would you be kind enough to call the owner for me? Madonna Solari is not in. Do you know where she is? I... Aiuto! Aiuto! Oh, Lucia, we thought you were gone for good. The men took us on a ship, and they released me, but she... Who took you on a ship? Slave traders, Messere, near Isola di Berina. They want coin in exchange for her life. I will get her back. Ooh, you sent me a picture of the Brutus armor. This is how the Brutus... Oh, that's cool! That one's actually cooler than the right in armor so far. It's pretty dope. Okay, deliver the money necessary to save the mistress. Okay, I guess I'll do this real quick. Big boy guard. In black with a gun. Gotcha. Hang on, I just saw something. Let's see, database. Recent entries. Oh, we already know about them. That's such a more glamorous name than prostitute. Courtesans. Brothel. Never happened to those names. Old A to walk into civilians to steal their money. Okay. So I need to raise enough money to... Free somebody. Is that what's happening here? I'm assuming that's exactly what's happening here. So much money. Do I have to pay them? Can I fight them? I don't know what's happening. I mean, I guess it'd be wrong to fight them. It's wrong to have slaves anyway, so I don't know. What do I do? Yeah, but I'm enjoying... I'm enjoying pickpocketing too. I figured if I'm going to pay a bunch, I'm trying to raise up 2,500 because I'm going to lose 2,500 anyway. Alright. Out in the open. Thanks for hanging out, guys. This has been another fun little adventure train that never stops going through every game ever 
And you should have been here for uh, Five Nights at Freddy's. Michael, that was a thing. That was not easy. I Kudos to anybody. I thought that was just some little silly kids game. I mean, it was legitimately hard. I got through them both. But uh, it, it's definitely... I realize why a lot of people make YouTube videos of it and stuff, and they stop. They get to night four and they don't keep going. I'm like, huh, that's kind of a funny coincidence. It's because it's hard. <laughs> Nobody ever wants to finish it. It's pretty, pretty, uh, pretty tough. That was a fun challenge. And so, I know, I know the slave trader thing, but I really want to kill this guy. Oh, what are you doing? Why is he being weird? These are those stupid controls that really stop. Okay. Easy. 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 Okay, he's, he's, he's escaped. So, I'm just going to kill these guys, come back later. I forgot that they can escape, and then you can't... Okay. Okay. Go ahead and fall in the water, guys. Thank you. That's funny that the water kills them. <laughs> Alright, I forgot that those guys can escape, so I got to get them before he escapes next time. That's all. I remember now. He just I walked into on. a door. Yeah. Let her go. No. Take it up with Cesare. Being adept at sleight of hand leads to good pickpocketing. <laughs> this is true, Normcore. There's some uh there's some really cool stuff that I have yet to show you involving pickpocketing for sure. It's not easy. Still kind of practicing some of that stuff. It's ridiculous. I can't um, see him anymore. There. Um, can you come down? <laughs> Are you kidding me? Am I gonna have to shoot you? I'm gonna have to shoot you. So I guess there was no, there was no, there was no negotiating peacefully, right? I mean, I was supposed to just kill them anyway, or did I do something wrong? I don't know. I don't know if I'll ever know the answer to that one. Tell me, Michael. Tell me everything. I forget about my horse. That dude was hiding, man. He was he was up there doing hidden Sasquatch crouchy moves. Trying to <laughs> What's this music all about? We got some Tim Burton stuff going on. Tim Burton presents Assassin's Creed. Oh. You know what? This is why I don't like horses. I, I just don't. I, I can't. I'm just going to go the long way. But in a way, it's quick. Can't explain it. It just is. And up. And over. There we go. Alright. Look at all these places to upgrade. Things to do. Maybe I'll work on some of that too. Not off stream, but just. Oh look, we can do a little, little hoop, 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 hoop. Dude, this guy needs to make some parkour videos. Ezio, he's he's legit. <laughs> he was trying to become one with the boat. That guy. All right. This is where we leave it. Don't forget, if you are a fan of magic tricks or just want to make fun of them, I don't care. If you think they're, you know how they're done, fine by me. Whatever it may be. If that sounds like it's up your alley, follow me on YouTube. Also, hang tight, because them videos are coming. All the previous playthroughs of whatever I've done so far. And, um... We'll see about that Discord. We'll see. Um, that might be where I like post a list of uh, keep kind of maintain a list of all the games that I've played and maybe rank them. Eventually, that'll get hard to do, but I'll do it by like category, you know, genre. I know Celeste is definitely up high in the 2D genre, as much as I complained about it, but that's because I was playing it and I'm not used to playing those kind of games. And it was my first playthrough ever, and it was a 10-hour stream, and it was crazy, but I loved it. Can't wait for the train station. You can meet me on uh, my sister's Discord for now. What are you doing in Rome? Norm, if you're still there, I think you should be able to post a link. Or rather, I do not know. 
They're cool people. Go to Firenze. Why? It's I'm there a lot. To help. I was trying to help you by sending you to Firenze. Where is Madonna Solari? She's dead. Merda. What now? Will we have to close? You cannot close. I need your help. Messere, without someone who can run things, we're finished. I'll do it. You do not belong here, Claudia. I know how to run a business. I ran Uncle Mario's for years. <laughs> yeah. This is different. What alternative do Ezio you have? has uh, no chill. You do this, Claudia. And you are on your own. I've been on my own for 20 years. Fine. I intend to repair the brothel. This place is a real mess. And I want your courtesans to find Katarina Sforza. You can count on us. Sounds magnificent. Normcore. I will send it to you. Um, I can I can send you a Discord on it. That's why to speak to the architect. This is where we're gonna leave it, guys. Thank you so much for hanging out.